everybody, and welcome back to Blue Jays today, folks, for our second 2024 regular season Toronto Blue Jays live stream. Yesterday was electric. Yeah. This team yeah. is a wagon. 162 and 0? Question mark. Potentially, <laughs> we're gonna find out today if we can keep kicking ass on the sticks and taking names on the mound. I'm your host, Nicholas Playlock. I'm your host, Adam Peddle. Yeah, guys, yesterday was phenomenal. The bats, they put up eight runs. The pitching only let up two. That is a recipe for success mm -hmm. and winning. And we got another great pitcher on the mound today, Chris Bassett. We'll get into the details about him a little bit later. We look at the lineup cards, and we're rolling out pretty much an identical lineup. So I think we know what we're doing here. We're, we're trying to replicate the formula, which is what we saw yesterday. If we can get what we saw yesterday, again today, I think it's going to be quite a successful series for the Toronto Blue Jays. Yeah, man. I mean, if I was John Schneider, there is no way that I am messing mm -hmm. with anything in this lineup, right? It felt like you got contributions from effectively everyone. There was one or two guys that just weren't with it yesterday. <laughs> IKF. IKF. Yeah. I'm, I'm um, giving him time. I'm giving him time. Of course, of course. I mean, the poor guys had like four or five at bats. You literally, know? literally. But either way, guys, whenever you put up eight runs and you're just all over the place like the Toronto Blue Jays were yesterday, you keep it the same, and that is what they're mm -hmm. going to do. Quick shout out here to Eton. 2700 oh. with the first donation your name is off on the wall of mvps and shout out to the 75 people who are already watching with us guys cheers to all of you yeah guys. it's friday <laughs> that means friday beers uh if you guys are drinking along with us then uh then let us know in the chat also too happy easter i mean ha i know yeah. baseball's back and we're doing the whole baseball thing happy easter to everybody go enjoy uh go enjoy, enjoy your time with your families mm -hmm. uh we're enjoying our time with our family the toronto blue jays <laughs> and we're doing it with you guys as well let's uh, take a look at that lineup yeah i agree all right, looking over at the Toronto Blue Jays, like I said, very similar lineup. You got George Springer, who had a Springer dinger. Got the offense cooking for the Blue Jays after they went nine up, nine down to start the game. And then you have Vladimir Guerrero Jr., who had an absolute moonshot to deep center field. Was it 450 or more? We don't know, but it was an absolute bomb. We know that for sure. Bo Bichette at the shortstop position. He had a good game going two for four. Justin Turner, one of the guys who did not have a hit yesterday. Let's hope that he can get his first hit as a Toronto Blue Jay in this one. Dalton Varsho as well. He's looking for his first hit. Alejandro Kirk doing what Kirk does, driving in runs with clutch singles up the middle. He went one for three with two RBIs. Kevin Kiermaier also went one for three with an RBI single too to add on to that big six inning for the Blue Jays. Then you have Isaiah Kiner Falefa. Can he get his first hit? We'll see. Kevin Biggio, MVP with the highest OPS in the major leagues right now at two point, well, starting the day, that's probably different now, at 2.7. Five zero, isn't that crazy? Uh, yeah, man, he's a wagon this year, dude. He's a wagon. He's MVP for a reason. Yeah, literally. All right, and then what we said uh, off the top of the show, Chris Bassett, he's going to be getting the starting duties for the Toronto Blue Jays. I'm expecting exactly what I've expected from Chris Bassett all last season, which is to be consistent, give me innings, strike batters out, mm -hmm. and give the Blue Jays a chance to win against the Tampa Bay Rays are still pretty tricky. Yeah, uh, I mean, similar lineup as well for them. You got Yandy Diaz leading things off. Uh, I said it yesterday it, it, when we were doing this game. Holy shit, that guy's good at baseball, and he's underrated as all holy hell, so keep an eye on him. You got Brandon Lowe batting second. Randy Rosarina, he was hitless. He's batting third. Isaac Paredes batting fourth. Palacios moving up a spot. He's going to be fifth mm. for these Tampa Bay Rays. And Harold Ramirez moving down a spot. He is going to be sixth. For them, Jose Siri, he had a, I think he had a pretty sneaky hit and then stole a bag as well. He's going to be batting seventh for them. Then you got Rortvet, somebody Who? make me familiar with this guy. <laughs> I've never heard of this guy in my life. Rort, Rortvet, and then Caballero down there uh, batting ninth. And they're all going for Aaron Savali. Savali, we broke this down on a few of our recent shows. Hasn't been great in his career against the Toronto Blue Jays. There's been a lot of Toronto Blue Jays hitters who have had his number. I feel really good about this matchup. I feel good about our pitcher versus their pitcher, our lineup versus their lineup. How can you not when you saw what we did yesterday? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking this one's going to be a W. I agree. And like you said in our uh, show uh, this morning, our Blue Jays Today show, 
this was the, the game to bet your life on. If you had yeah. to bet on a W for the Blue Jays in this series, this is the one that matchup pitching-wise is really good. Uh, I liked the one yesterday. I like this one better, mm -hmm. and we saw what our lineup could do. However, you know, the, the Rays, they had a quiet day yesterday. They were threatening a little bit. They had a quiet day. Uh, I expect them to be a little bit more dangerous and pressing. Even though we do have Chris Bassett, I do expect them to try to have another sort of a, a, a gear in them to try and get some uh, runs on the board. Well, with that being said, let's get some official score predictions mm -hmm. in the chat. Everybody, there's 121 people watching. We haven't even got the first pitch yet. Nope. If you guys haven't already done so, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. This is the place to be if you're going to watch these games along with us, guys. Mm -hmm. We're going to be doing this game, tomorrow's game, the game on Sunday as well, and then you, you, we're going to throughout the entire yep. season doing roughly three games a week going live with everybody here. Wow, so what a great deal that is. That sounds like an awesome deal <laughs> if I hit the subscribe button. For free, for free. Guys, <laughs> yeah. Uh, but let's get your score predictions in the chat right now, guys. Uh, Rufiel saying 4-1 to one Jays, 6-4 to four Jays from Jordan, 9-1 to one Jays, says Raphael. I love how after one day, because yesterday, like, the score predictions, most of them were Jays, but it was, like, pretty tight. It was mm -hmm, pretty close. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It, it was like, a you know, oh, like, we're going to win, like, 3-1 or, like, 4-2 mm -hmm. or something. Now we're getting 9-1 out here. You know? <laughs> People are feeling, so, feeling themselves after yesterday's offensive performance, seven five Jays from Daniela. I'm kind of, I like that prediction a lot. Seven That's five. Not bad. I'm thinking honestly, for me though, I might I might go a little bit. I don't know because Aaron Savali kind of blows. Um, right. <laughs> You go first. You go first. Yeah, I, I'm going to expect a little bit of regression. You know, if they get any better, like, my God, let's set, let's get the parade ready to work. In, uh, let's get it organized right now in Toronto for the boys when they return. Mm -hmm. um, I'm thinking a little bit less offensive uh, production. I'm thinking five runs for the Jays. And like I said, a little bit of pushback from the Rays. Not two runs. They'll get three. It's a 5-3 victory for your Toronto Blue Jays. 5-3. Okay, a little bit of a nail-biter there. Yep, That's yep. going to be tough and tricky. It obviously depends, like when we score our runs, when they score mm -hmm. their runs, but assuming that that is the final score, that means that you see Jimmy Garcia, that yep. means that you see Chad Green, obviously, like, depending on when the runs mm. are scored and everything, but but probably you're going to have to fire off a lot of those bullets in that bullpen yep. if that's what happens. Um, you know what? I was going to talk myself out of going high, but then I, I, I re-kind of talked myself into it because <laughs> we're fucking wagon and Aaron Savali's not that good at baseball. So I'm going to say that actually we do repeat and that they do put up an eight spot on the Tampa Bay Rays. There will be a little mm. bit more pushback. I'm going 8-4. Eight, 8-4 four. Eight, okay. four today, Toronto Blue Jays. That feels like a good uh, line right there. Mm. I mean, we got, a, we got a big one here, 27-4. Jays from Jared Williams, the Yankees fan, Dude. who all Jays fans out there right now. This Yankee fan, Jared, wants us to beat the Rays. We're teaming up with the Yankees. I think everybody in the AL East agrees, let's just get rid of those Tampa Bay Rays. We're sick and tired of it, man. Yeah. It's, it's a mosquito. I don't want to deal with it anymore. Look, I feel bad for Tampa Bay because yeah, at the end of yeah, the day, yeah. it's like they're doing their best out there. <laughs> they don't have the, the same payroll that anybody else has. And, like, literally there's no fans there to even watch these guys. So I feel bad for them. I really, really I do. Have. At the same point, <laughs> I don't feel bad enough not to want to whoop their ass. So they, they've let's won. Do that. They've had their chances. They've won a lot. It's time to go. Exactly. It's time to you know go. what? That's the thing. Like, if you haven't won the World Series in the last couple of years, sorry, you missed the boat. It's other That's people's turn saying. now. It's That's other people's saying. turn. You know? it, it, it's the Blue Jays. It's the Orioles. And no, no offense, Jared. Even though you're on our team, I really hope that your team kind of falls out of the race too. And then it, it's gonna be the new wave of Baltimore and uh, Toronto Blue Jays, like it was in 2016. That would be good. Wouldn't that be a funny, like cyclical thing that happens there? Right? It's like both of those squads go through their mm -hmm. own rebuilds. You know, obviously Baltimore's a little bit longer than ours, but yeah. granted, we haven't won a playoff game in that time either. No. So, no. I mean, but, but then it's like, now you're you're back, right? Yeah, it's like, oh, yeah. you're back, you know? So, Gotta yeah, I'm it. going 8-4 to four Jays. You're going 5-4 to four Jays. We've got a lot more score predictions in here. 8-5 Jays. I'm right there with you, Sam. 9-4, 6-3. I haven't seen a single person predict the Tampa Bay Rays. No. I haven't seen a single goddamn person predict the Tampa Bay Rays. <laughs> Everyone's that feeling is, high. Oh, of course, dude. Of course, right? And no one wants to admit it. No uh -huh. one wants to admit it because, like, then you're going to get these people on the internet being like, oh, it's one game. Like, stop overreacting. But, I mean, the, the feeling yesterday, watching these guys come out and, and show up after this whole offseason, it's been down in the dumps, and there's been criticism by, by tons of analysts, and people were saying that Otani coming to Toronto would be bad for baseball, and that the offense isn't good enough, and they need to bring baseball. stuff in, right? All of that. To then come out and then to, to put, put up a performance like that, you know, it, it proves the haters wrong a little bit. It's just more, for me, like, I'm obviously... Not thinking it's going to be like this is it. This is what we're going to see the entire season, 161. Mm -hmm. But for me, it's like, hey, 
Ears. Nice. Yeah. That, like, literally, I can't really describe it other than, like, good job. Good job, yeah. Jays. Like, nice. Good. We, we saw what could be. Now, are we going to see that every single time? No. I think we might have a chance to see it again today. I do. But uh, if we can see it maybe in the, in the games where we're not expected to win. Also, we weren't expected to win yesterday. We're not expected to win today, according to Vegas. Mm -hmm. But I personally think, and Nick thinks too, we're not expected to win in the next two games after this one. So if we could put up a fight in the games where we're handicapped or crippled a little bit in terms of our pitching depth, Right, because we're gonna have to get a lot more innings. If we can win those games, then that would be exceptional. Dude, that's what wins you championships, okay? Like, there's no team that goes through the whole season without having an injury bug at some point, right? Mm -hmm. the, the, the team that wins the World Series, there's a time in the season where they gotta, you know, stomach a, a bit of a bit of an injury bug. They gotta mm -hmm. handle it. They gotta mm -hmm. weather the storm, right? We're getting ours a little early right now. I'm hoping that you know it doesn't get a whole lot worse than this. I imagine that there's going to be other stretches in this season where other key guys are going to be on the IL. That's just how shit goes. Uh, but you, you got to prove it. You got to weather the storm with the guys that you have and the depth that you have. Yo, real quick shout out to Scream saying, No beers tonight, you little soft weights. Excuse me. Yeah. Excuse well, me. Take it back. Take it back. Take that guys. back, Scream. Take it back. <laughs> Guys, we got 189 people in here, and we have not even seen the first pitch yet. If you haven't already, guys, hit that like button and smash the subscribe button. We're trying to get to 23.8K subscribers. We got almost 100 yesterday of you guys coming in, new people in here. So welcome in to everybody who was new yesterday mm -hmm. and is coming back again for game two. And if you are new right now, join those guys. Join the community. We're doing a little thing. We just like came up with it today when we're on our Blue Jays Today show at 12. Where if you guys send us pictures, uh, email, Instagram, Twitter, whatever it might be, if you send us a picture of you watching this live stream or you in some sort of Blue Jays Today merchandise or Blue Jays Today gear or Blue Jays gear and, and something to do with our community, we will post it uh, out on our, um, well, we'll put it up on our stream. For uh, Friday, yeah, so well, that would be dope. You know what? We we got to come up with a segment name for it. We got to yes, come up with do. a segment name because right now I'm just thinking it. You know, it's, it's it's unorganized thing where people are coming. We need we need to uh, title you guys something. You know, we that's give what I'm you... thinking. I want to give them like names. Mm -hmm. You know, like you got Swifties. Mm -hmm. You know, like what what <laughs> what are you guys? Yeah, for real. BJ's. No. BJ's. BJ. Yeah. B -B BJT. BJT. That's, I guess. Doesn't you know, work. Doesn't uh, today, guys, gang. Today, do, gang. Do you think that uh, God starts Sunday or Monday? Uh, I have no idea, and I can't even uh, care to to make a guess at this point. Uh, yeah. uh, John John Schneider came out and said mm -hmm. that tomorrow. That's when they're going to talk about it. That's when the information is going to be revealed. I'm excited to see what they do decide. Personally, I would prefer him to start in Houston, and mm -hmm. I actually wonder if the outcome of this game, maybe even impacts that a little bit i don't know maybe if you take two off the top against the tampa bay rays you're feeling more inclined to start the series with kevin gosman in houston right and then pitch bowen bowen francis here i don't know maybe i'm talking about my ass right now but either way i prefer him to start in houston and uh, and let bowden play tampa yeah i think at the end of the day it comes down to what does gosman feel like if gosman feels like he wants to pitch a certain day, you kind of you go with what Gosman's feeling. Just right? listen to the guy right. that was third in Cy yeah, Young. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> right? He knows himself better than anybody right now, so I think we'll have to wait and see. And yeah, like you said, we'll find out tomorrow what that decision's going to be. Also, a quick shout out to the uh, uh, Buffalo Bisons. They played today. Ricky T got the start. Yeah. He was roughed up he a little bit, uh, but our boy, our mm -hmm. guy, the, the Blue Jays today, OG. Addison Barger, two for five, oh, yeah. coming up clutch. Mm -hmm. I sent him a message after the game, said, hey, congrats on a great first game. We're going to be following along with you for a while. That guy's going to be something mm -hmm. special for these Toronto Blue Jays. Got to love it. Um, uh, G uh, J L Rocco asking, you guys think Bowden and Francis could be very good as the five starter this year? I think so. I, I said it right off the top, like early in spring training, that, yeah, I think he's got – all the capabilities of being a good five. It just all depends how much length are you gonna get out of him. That's gonna be the decision right there. I know. <laughs> this is uh, this is hilarious, guys. They're, they're, right now they're highlighting the, the the brawl that transpired. Kind of a weak brawl. It was even, yeah, it was yeah, like it was, a shouting match. Just a shouting <laughs> match. But it was Reese Hoskins, it was Jeff McNeil who were at the center of it. Reese Hoskins, I don't know if there was intent behind it or not. Um, 
because honestly, looking at the it highlights, was intent, yeah. like it looked. Well, it also just looked like a terrible slide. <laughs> you know, yeah. like I don't know. It if, was very, it was very much intentional because like we know Reese has played in Philly. In I Philly, know yeah. that. Yeah, I know that he's had problems with mm -hmm. them in the past. So mm -hmm. I guess yeah, he, probably something there. Something what I heard is it. like he did like a slow trot against them when he was with the Phillies, mm -hmm. and then like they took exception to it and they're chirping. So then now he's back after a year, probably all fired up. Facing the Mets in his first game, like so, he's probably he probably had something in the moment where he wanted to take out Jeff McNeil. Listen, obviously you don't want to be taking people out because, like, God forbid, oh no, like Jeff McNeil mm -hmm. breaks his ankle there or something, yeah, right? Yeah. Because uh, like that that's a real thing that can happen. Um, but mm -hmm. I'm all for the heat and, and the fired up and you know having that competitiveness, you know, like and, and seeing the highlights afterwards where this guy is like weighing to himself and Jeff McNeil is like losing it. Mm -hmm. It's fucking hilarious, dude. I, from an outside that has no stake in it, it's hilarious. I saw Wardy, he's like, I fucking oh hate, yeah, I dude, hate Reese I saw that as well. Yeah, like I can <laughs> see how you know if this was a, a Tampa Bay Rays player, for instance, or oh, New York yeah. Yankee, like I would not be okay with. Yeah, this. someone sliding trying to like, and did you see how almost Jeff McNeil's like uh, ankle got? Like I broken. Didn't, I didn't see it that was either. like underneath at an awkward angle. Like it almost looked like if you freeze the frame, like this guy broke his ankle. Like that's bad, man. Yeah. That, that could be really bad. I know. No, I, again, like I've always, uh, I guess, taken exception to the fact of yeah, like people taking people out like that. Mm -hmm. Um, unless of course it is just anonymous naked and you you fuck up or you slip or something. I don't know what right, happens. Right, right. That one was like clearly because his whole <laughs> yeah, his whole body but, was over the bed. But similarly as well, uh, you know, like when pitchers throw at guys and when they peg uh -huh. them, I'm just like, dude, like. That's a ninety-five, like yeah. straight to the spine. Yeah. Like, ah. I wonder if I wonder if Reese is gonna get hit by a pitch tomorrow. I uh, probably. Yeah. That's the thing. He's probably, he probably getting he's, one. Yeah, he's yep. gonna he's gonna get one, and that's <laughs> and then it's gonna be well now it's now the Mets are at fault, and it's gonna be this back and forth battle now. I you know I love it and I hate it. I love it and I hate it. Uh, <laughs> I certainly love it. It's very entertaining, guys. We are about three minutes away from the first pitch in this game. Uh, we got a lot of a lot of stuff riding on this game right now. If you watched our Blue Jays Today show on on uh, Betway, we predicted a few things. I predicted that Bo Bichette and uh, Alejandro Kirk, they'd both get one hit. And I think Nick said that the Blue Jays would have the highest inning uh, as well in this game. But we most also made scored in most, or, yeah, most runs scored in an inning. Mm -hmm. But we also made some other bets, too. What's yeah. your bet that you made as well? I'm also saying I just took money line. I'm just saying yeah. Blue Jays win, man. Seriously, I, I'm standing by what I say, right? This is the game out of every game in this series that if I had to bet my life, I would. I would do it. And I, it's I plus think, money, too. That's right. It, like, it all comes down to the fact that the odds are just a little too good to pass up. If we were negative, I wouldn't have taken it. Mm -hmm. We are plus right now. You're getting more than, than what you bargained for. Uh, so for, in that regard, uh, I'm going to take it 10 times out of 10. All right, and I'm also going to take, uh, I took uh, a little parlay, excuse me, of Chris Bassett, four strikeouts, Bo Bichette, one hit, and then I've also got Blue Jay run line of plus two and a half, so they can't lose by three. If they don't lose by three, we're good. So, a little bit more trickier, but uh, I like it. I like it a lot. Rocco asking right now, do you think in the future MLB teams are going to have six starters rolling through the whole season to keep everybody fresh and healthy? Um... Well, it all depends. If uh, if every single one of those six starters are incredible and elite and deserve playing time, mm -hmm. then sure. You know, yeah, like yeah. It, like I, if everyone's coming out and pitching to a two and a half ERA, like I don't care who plays. <laughs> like fuck it, you know. Uh, if you know that's not the case, and you know you have a guy in there that's got like a five, well then you're gonna knock him out. So the only way that that would work and actually happen is if everyone was pulling their weight and there was never any downtime. Yeah, like, I could see a reality where the Toronto Blue Jays turn into a six-man rotation in August. Like, you know, we have a lot of pitching depth, and if we have, like, Bowden Francis and Alec Manoa up with the team and everyone's healthy and doing good, I could see us turning into a six-man. Hell, even Yariel Rodriguez is in the mix, right? So, like, mm -hmm. we have a lot of guys who deserve playing time, and I think that they might utilize that down the stretch. Yeah. Sophie asking, guys, you're going live for the Astros series. So we're doing all the Tampa Bay. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to be taking that first Astros game off, which is the uh, Monday. Mo mo or I guess the first, Monday two, and Tuesday. Yeah. the first two Astros games off then. Monday and Tuesday. We'll be back live again mm -hmm. on Wednesday. Adam's going to be soloing mm -hmm. it, I think, for the mm -hmm. most part. Wednesday is actually my birthday, folks. Yeah. And uh, my girlfriend's uh, doing doing stuff. I don't even know what's planned. She's just saying, like, you know, make sure that you're free. Mm -hmm. uh, I was like, okay, well. 
I've gone live and, and yeah, for like four yeah. days in a row. So. Maybe, maybe I'll ask Pat. Maybe I'll get Pat to fill out. Yeah, yeah, actually. yeah. Get Pat to text him and, and see if he can do it. That'd be fun. That'd be fun. All right, guys, we're getting going here. Aaron Savale is warming up. The Blue Jays are coming to the dish. We're going to have George Springer, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., and Bobo go boom, boom. Everybody's saying happy birthday, Nick. Not today, guys. Not today. It's on yeah. Wednesday. It'll be on Wednesday. So you can wish me happy birthday uh, a little bit later. But, yeah, I probably won't, won't be around for the Wednesday one. But we are going live on that last game. Mm -hmm. uh, just so everybody knows, and make sure I say this correctly, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday. Yeah. That's every it. Wednesday, every Friday, every Sunday, assuming that there mm -hmm. is a baseball game on those days, yeah. Blue Jays today is going to be live, so mark it in the calendar. Absolutely. George first, Springer. First pitch coming to him. Let's see. That is a slider away. Ball one, and we are underway in game two of Toronto Blue Jays season, 2024 edition. George Springer had that homer last night. If Sophie's in the chat, Sophie had a little poll today, or yesterday, on who would hit the first uh, home run of the Blue Jays season. I guessed wrong. What know. That's in there. That's uh, in there. Toronto Blue Jays actually posted kind of something similar, um, and I just responded with the David Schneider meme. So <laughs> I, I also guessed wrong. <laughs> <laughs> one and one on, uh, on George Springer. Aaron Savale fires. That one oh! is going to be... Foul. Quiet. Wow. Okay. That was a that was that a was leaking a, hanger. a leaking uh, uh, slider right there. So pregame, they were talking about George Springer's approach, and that uh, the word on the street is that he was told by Donnie Baseball, mm. hit the hangers, like see it and just rip it. That's you. And did it he did, he did. <laughs> just pulled it foul there. One and two. That Good one up. is going to be low. Good Look up. already. Already, I don't want to overreact, but already we're four <laughs> pitches in. Uh, does Aaron Savale look unhittable to you? No, no. I mean, that was a, that was a mistake pitch right mistake there. Mistake I mean, pitch. And then the, then the one that he followed it up with, not even close. You're not going to swing at that. Come on, George. Zavala you get, got this guy. Zavala get a little chunky to you? He was, oh, See, he did not that. go. He did not look go. That. that was way outside. You're not going there. He, he, well, I'll tell you right now, the, 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 the back side was, yeah. <laughs> was a little Dude, big. Dude, <laughs> I swear he wasn't that big. Maybe that's Tim Bay Ray way that, like, you need a bigger ass. <laughs> yeah. I don't ask questions. Yeah. It's all in the stats. <laughs> Full got, count right now on Savale. Come on, George. Get on, buddy. Here's the 3-2 pitch, George Springer. Dios, that's, that's ball a ball. Four. No! No, it's not! That no, was a it's horrible not. call. That was a horrible call. That's that was a horrible absolute call. bull right there. That was a there. horrible call. That is such bullshit. That was a horrible call. Horrible call. Take a look at this. That's nowhere close. That's not close. And George, oh, and George is pissed. And George, you know what? That's, that's upsetting, close. man. That's, a, that's not close. Because I, I hate when that shit happens because, y you know... You put up a good at bat, you yeah. should be rewarded. I agree. I agree. Guerrero. Guerrero now. Wings that on a slider away. That is going to be strike one. Let's go, Daddy. Yeah, yeah. for real. WTF. Exactly. Good. No, that's complete bull. Good old complete umpires. <laughs> so funny. Everyone's complaining about umpires on opening day, too, yesterday around the league. And it's like, yeah, we're back. Baseball's it's going to happen, man. 0 and 1 on Guerrero. Savale fires. Oh! That one is going to be. The fall, 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 fall. Yeah! Let's that's go. our dad. That's, That's our dad, father. everybody. Stay hot, baby. Let's go. Guerrero. Yep. Oh, I'm all on it. I'm on the train. I'm on the Guerrero so, resurgence train. Tell me that was a fastball. Yep, that was a little two-seamer. Two-seam and action. He, and he was on the jammed. Hands. And he was able to get the barrel to it. And I yep. love that. Bobo now. Go, boom, boom. Let's get the bombs in the chat, everybody. Bombs. Bombs in the chat. Let's go. Oh, I like this team, guys. I, I, I like this Game team. Game two, and I'm already in. I'm already in. Come on, Bobo. Come on, Bobo. Yeah, it's strike okay. one. See, if that strike was called correctly, we'd have runners on first mm -hmm. and second. With nobody out, we'd be chilling. For real. For, oh. exactly, it changes the complexity of, of the entire game, and you'd have no outs right now. So even if Bo double played, you, you know, the inning's still alive. Right, You've right. got a runner on. Changes the complexity of the inning. Got all the bombs in the chat. Gotta love it, guys. 0-1. Bobo Shet, this is part of my bet here. I need Come you, buddy. Come on, Bobo. Let's go crazy. Let's go crazy. Deals. Good yeah, eye. yeah, Good yeah. Eye. Well Good done. Eye. Well Good done. Eye. One and one. One and one. Lay off the slider. Vladdy swung at the first slider, but didn't he? Wow, that's crazy. He swung at the first slider off the plate, fouled it off, and then he got jammed with the two-seamer. Great sequence by Savale, but yeah, well, Vladdy's just better. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, great sequence. Yeah, you know, you're right, dude. That's how I bitch and MLB the show. I try <laughs> yeah. to, anyways. Yeah. One and one on Bichette. Ah, uh, fouls on the way. Okay. One what was two. that? Was that like a like it would be a sinker. Yeah, yeah. kind of looked like yeah. it, it dropped. 
Gladio. You're not going last. Come on. Come on. You're not going. Yeah, Yanni's like, get, get out of here, guy. Get out of here. <laughs> One and two on Bobo. Let's go, baby. Trying to go upstairs. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Does. Defensive swing. Defensive swing right there. That's what he does. 265 people in the chat right now. Shut in and thank you to everybody who is currently in here. Let's bump this thing up to 69 likes. Oh, who is going to be the 69th like, everybody? Who's going to be the 69th like? Also, shout out to Dylan. Who is saying Vladdy's starting the season oh, looking elite? We already, yes, have, we already have 76. Oh, oh, that is a strikeout. Bobo. Got him totally fooled. Yeah, that was way out in front. We also, yeah, we have 76 likes. Who, who is 69? Who is 69? Guys, what's going on right now? Are we forgetting? Wait, I'm, we're going back. I'm finding it. I'm number 69, says Daniela Castro. Let's go. Bam. Let's go. Bam, there it is. MVP, W's in the chat. Wow. Daniela. You guys are already smashing the likes so much. We're like, oh, it already happened. Justin Turner now up with two out. Vladdy at first. That is a strike. I get the call. It clipped a little bit. Look, this guy's got a wide strike zone today, everybody, especially on the outer half. We want Dylan, says Tom Dinner. You hear that, Dylan? <laughs> you got fans, man. You got fans. They remember you. 0-1 right now on JT. That one's outside. Come on, turn and burn, baby. Turn and burn. <laughs> I also made another graphic today for when Jose Barrios pitches again. Mm. It's uh, from the Terminator movie. Let's, uh, <laughs> well, maybe in the half inning you can, yeah. you can show it off. A little preview. One-on-one on one right now on Justin Turner outside. Oh. Okay, we do a little pump fake down to Vladdy at first, and he dives back fanatically. <laughs> Rizbo saying, newly subscribed. Cheers, every Jays Let's fan. Go. Let's go. W's Cheers. in the chat for our new subscribers, guys. You're incredible. You guys are all incredible. Best fucking community on the internet. Two-on-one right now on Justin Turner. Burner, come on, man, burn. Burn and burn, baby, here's the pitch. Ah, fouls off a good pitch on the outer half right there. You know, it's too bad that he's not, like, a steel threat, because I feel like that's the turn and burn that I think about, you know? Yeah, like, I think yeah. turn and burn, turn and burn. It's, like, it's yeah. like, boof, you're off, you know? No, like, you're already stealing. It's more turn. Yeah, like, you got to turn on the fastball, the Exit ball, velocity, know? yeah. That's what it is, yeah. Two and two right now on Justin Turner. Go, Turner. Now, this is where Turner should have a long... Fight here, three and two. This is what he does, man. This is what he does. Yeah, Battle, get on. Yeah, dude, I, I don't I know anything. About, like, I really don't know the stats on this. So somebody please like look it up if you have the time. But I would wager a bet that he's got to be up there in quality at bats. Yeah, he's got to be uh, up there I in believe quality it. at bats. Full this count. is one right here. Oh my oh, God! No way! That is horrible. That is garbage. That's horrible. And Justin Turner is giving a piece of. His oh mind. my God! That is horrible. We better get those. Oh, we, we better, better, get, better those. get those. We better get those. That is not even close, dude. This that guy is just not literally close. fucked our inning. Man. Wow, wow. We, we could have had three runners on. We should have bases loaded, bases loaded with, with one out. Yeah. Literally. Wow. What on wow. earth wow. are we doing wow. here? Wow. Wow. Do you want to lose your job, umpires? Okay. Why are you doing this? Hey, Siri, remind me tomorrow to look at the umpire scorecard and post it on Twitter. Oh, my God. Yeah. Dude, maybe we need maybe we need an umpire graphic oh, when yeah. they mess up, <laughs> you know? Oh, God. That was terrible. I, that I, was I, terrible. I can't, I can't believe it. I, I'm throwing a tweet out here right now. Yeah, literally. Tweet about that. Wow. I'm actually kind of tilted right now. I'm genuinely so tilted. We're, uh, one in, we're one inning in. I'm already upset. You know? <laughs> Dylan, do you have, like, maybe a screenshot of, like, that? Can you get that, like, last strike call, Dylan? Dude, like, I, I just... It, it frustrates me to no end. Because, you know, okay, fine. You look at this. This tiny little inning in a vacuum. And, all right, we don't score there. Okay, you know, maybe that goes on to affect the game. Maybe not. But what I really hate is that... Now you're forcing these guys to get out of their approach, even though their wow. approach was working and it should have worked, right? I but know. now they're going to go back to the dugout and they're going to go, well, what do I do? Like, do you, I have to swing at that? Do no, I not? You know, it's like. You, you just don't. That was literally a foot off the plate. You just never swing at that. You just never swing at that. Wow. I hate it. I hate it. Wow. I'm gonna. Oh, I could probably find it actually. Yeah, if you could find it. I just did a quick tweet. All right. Okay. Chris Bassett now on the bump. Mm. Oh, yeah, like looking for the strike. Oh, oh, oh. I got it. I got it. I know where to find it. Chris wow. Bassett up on the mound right now, everybody. We better get those calls. That's yep. all I'm gonna say. Okay, that yep. is a. 
first pitch strike right there, right at the bottom of the zone. 0-1 right now on Yandy Diaz. This guy is filthy, folks. This guy is truly filthy. Incredible game of baseball yesterday. Bassett fires. That one is outside. 1-1 one one right My now. My God. My God. Okay. Wow. I got it. Look at this. Look at this. Horrible. Horrible. That is terrible, yeah. Oops, what the fuck? <laughs> One and two on Yanni Diaz. Right at, right on the corner. You gotta love it. All right, Chris Bassett, three pitches in. One and two, looking for a strikeout here. Yanni Diaz, definitely the most dangerous player in this lineup for the Tampa Bay Rays. Bassett fires. That one is swung on. Let's missed, go, and baby. You're sat down. You're sat down. One strikeout, and that's the, I mean, that's the biggest guy in this lineup right here that you got you to take care of. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, I was like number 100. Shout out that we're already at 100 Let's likes. Go. You guys are the best. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button and smash the subscribe button. If you guys subscribe, your name will pop up literally right here. Wow, I'm getting George's here too. Abysmal. Just abysmal. Bassett fires. That one swung on and missed by Chris Bassett. Just an FU fastball right there. Pumps it in the zone. You can't catch up, Brandon. You can't. Brandon Lowe, uh, you know, still a solid season last year. 771 OPS, but not as good as what he's done in the past. Here's the 01. That's one fouled away. Fouled off. Yeah, just pump the fastball again because it was working after that first one. Anyone else liking the old school Devil Rays jerseys? Actually, yeah. Yes, like, yes. I am liking it. You know, I, I hate <laughs> I hate that team, but I, I can't hate on their jerseys, especially the old ones. I think they're cool. Pitch clock winding down. Three seconds. Bassett fires. That one. Okay. Well, why aren't we getting that call, um? That yeah, clip, seriously. That clip. Yeah, it's, Bassett's it's... like, okay, yeah. <laughs> one and two. On low. And he gets the strikeout. Let's go. I just finished the tweet, and now I'm looking up at Chris Bassett mowing down the rain. <laughs> All right. All right. He is mowing them down right Let's now. Let's go. Dude. That's two strikeouts. I just I need four. There's yeah, two. Yeah, that, that was the lock of locks when it came to that. Yeah, that, that was an right easy. That was an easy sure. one. Chris Bassett, his pitch arsenal, uh, what is that, eight, eight nine pitches that this guy eight throws? Pitches, That's yeah. just wild, and it's insanity. Rosarena now up to the dish, starting with the fastball. Getting ahead in the count. I like what we're mm -hmm. doing here, you know? This is how you play baseball. <laughs> this is this is a classic Chris Bassett. What if Chris Bassett has another level to him this year? That wouldn't that be phenomenal? Wow. <laughs> and our rotation's this unreal. Team is winning 162 and 0. <laughs> yeah, now. literally. 0 and 2 right now. And again, this wow. is a, a beautiful beginning to this inning, to this game. Lots of ball to play, but we're getting ahead of these hitters. Every single one of yep. these counts so far, he's been ahead of them. Yeah, 10 pitches so far. This will be the 11th. And if you get the strikeout right here, then that would be phenomenal. Here's the 0-2. Whip. Oh, my God. It, it was low, but, like, come on, man. Like, if you're going to – yeah, Chris Bassett knows. Like, you're not going to give me those ones? Wow. Here's the one, two. Coming inside. That one misses high. That one misses high. Two and two. I could look. Chris Bassett looks a little pissed off right now. <laughs> I can see it in behind his eyes. Here's the two, two. Oh, and he oh. fouls it off, but he throws his bat at the third base umpire. What does the Radio Rosarina have against him? That was a good pitch, though, by, uh, he was had him way out in front. He literally had to throw the bat hat at it. Wham. Flies off. Yo, shout out to Tom Dinder with the dono. $4.99 dono saying, Dylan says he can fill in when one of you guys are away from the channel. We want Dylan. All right, well, we'll, <laughs> we'll get him back. We'll get him back. I mean, he's, if he wants he's to got, He's got a long in, drive. <laughs> yeah, if he wants to fill in this coming Wednesday. Yeah, you want to drive down here Wednesday, <laughs> Dylan? Two and two right now on Randy Rosarena. Chris Bassett fires. Oh that my is a God. swing and a miss, and that's the third strikeout. That's nasty. That's nasty. Chris Bassett looking absolutely filthy. 
this inning. My God. Okay. Look, I actually felt so good about that inning if it weren't for the umpire being dumb. Mm-hmm. And I feel even better that we had Chris Bassett dominating. Yep. And it wasn't gimme calls. It was pure strikes. Yeah, exactly. We were getting well, that's the thing, right? Like, there were a couple calls there that he could have gotten and he yeah. didn't get. Yeah, exactly. Well I done, Chris Bassett. Exceptional first inning of work right there, guys. Just tweeted about him. If you're not already uh, following us on Twitter, then the link to do so is right pinned in the chat. Go follow us on there. We're tweeting a bunch mm-hmm. more. Uh, we want to have uh, we want to have our whole community on there, guys. Yeah. Uh, tweet, be tweet at us if, be uh, if you want, you know. All right, real quick, guys. Time to debut the La Maquina. Let's go. Burger, 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 oh, burger, wrong one. Wrong one. Get to watch the Danny Burgers. That's Danny Burgers one. Whenever he comes up, you're going to see that one. This is La Maquina. <laughs> Just simply <laughs> dominating. Yeah, let's go, everybody. That's the, the first machine. time that I'm seeing that, too, guys. That is La Maquina. <laughs> Just a robot coming at you to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, and shout out to the gaming freak who just got... Oh my God! Bautista three backflip for three months. Oh my God! Oh, the Bautista backflip uh, tier. Let's freaking go, dude! The MVPs to start the season is wild, man. This feels like the Toronto Blue Jays offense out here in the fucking chat, guys. For real. This is what it feels like so far. Three up. Wow. Three down for Chris Bassett. Love three it. strikeouts. Woo! Love it. Just pure domination. And now, let's get the sticks going. We've got Dalton Varsha. We got Alejandro Kirk and Kevin Kiermaier in this inning. Get it going. Don Varsho stepping up to the box. Come on. Come on. Top of the second right now. The Varsho. Let's go. Out here. Let's go. What did he do yesterday? He, he, did... he went 0 for 3. I think I had a walk. Right. Okay. Yeah. He, I know he got on. I wasn't sure if it was a hit or a walk, but quieter game for Varsho for sure. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. What is happening? Dude, this is unacceptable. This is unacceptable. What does this ump have against the dude? He took dude, Ray's money line. He took Ray's money line. He, he took, took Ray's, Ray's money line. Is that like, a strike? Oh I'm my god! I'm genuinely kind of tilted right now. That's three terrible calls yeah, yeah. just against us. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's just ridiculous. Just against us. All right. One on one. Yo, shout out to Gaming Freak with the fifty dollar donation. Yes. Holy crap! Oh baby, W's in the chat right now. Don Marshall oh. skies that one. That's gonna be an out. That's gonna be, That's an out, gonna right be an out. Caught by the catcher. Yeah, caught by the catcher. Yeah. But W's in the chat for the Gaming Freak, who's Let's making go. it all worthwhile right now, dude. Thank you so much for all the donate. You've been crazy. You've been incredible in dude. the past forty eight hours, dude. Like we just gotta keep your name up here forever, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much. All right, now we got the captain. Captain Kirk, you're up, baby. Wow, I'm, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get pissed off. I feel like if this is the reason why we lose, I'm gonna be cheesed. Oh, absolutely. Now you got Dalton swinging at things that he shouldn't be swinging at. Well, yeah, and you can't even blame the poor guy. No. Yeah, that is a strike there to Captain Kirk, right at the top of the zone. 0 and 1 right now on Alejandro Savale. 23 pitches in. Come on, Kirk, make me cut a clip. For you. The side very or, close yeah. to what should have been <laughs> yeah. a strike for this Literally, umpire. Dude, yeah, you, you can't even, <sighs> you can't gauge it anymore, man. Top of the second on the captain. Navale, 24 pitches. Captain about 333 on the season. Probably where his numbers finish. <laughs> yeah. That strike? Like, where? Two and one. Captain staying patient. This is the most yeah. important thing for him. Like, if I could put one word and I could staple it to Captain, it is patience. Like, mm-hmm. the calm approach that he has is unparalleled. And he chops one to the right uh, side. He's going to be yeah. an He is right running there. fast, my God, for Kirk standards. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I'll it. tell you right now, I don't know necessarily if he's, like, a lot fitter than he was last year, but he's definitely not, yeah, he's definitely not different either. <laughs> no. kind of uh, I mean, it was a high chopper, so, like, you know, if you had... Speed like Bobby Wood Jr., like you might have a chance. Mm. All right, two out so far in this inning, and Kevin Kiermaier stepping up to the dish. What can we do here? Jurgen says, Sometimes it feels like all sports are fixed. You know what, buddy? Yeah. It, it does feel Let's like that. Like so, and they never fixed in my favor. Why are they, no. you know, why? why not us? I mean, I've said it multiple times on this channel. You can go look at the stats out there, they're fully pages that have the evidence. But uh, here's the old one. That one's fouled away. 0-2. Oh 
But there is a, a clear swing when it comes to umpire decisioning against the Toronto Blue Jays every year. We're mm -hmm. one of the top teams, if not the top team, every single year when we lose calls against the umpires. We don't get them when it comes to balls and strikes. 0-2. So, yeah, I do feel like they're against me. That's a ball. A little bouncer in the dirt. One and two. Come on. Come on. Blue Jays versus umpire so far. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Listen, it's the first inning. We had a rough first inning in the, in the home opener. Or the season opener, excuse me. We did. Me. We did. But we came back. One and two. Volley. That's going to strike three. Oh, oh my god. Oh, and okay. he doesn't get that a makeup and, call? Okay. Uh, he's a guy I don't bad. know what the hell this umpire <laughs> is doing because that actually was a perfect pitch was by perfect. Aaron Savale. That probably should have been strike three. Yeah. Doesn't get it. Who's um, umpiring this game? An idiot. An idiot. Can dude. someone tell us who's umpiring this game? It's a complete moron. Uh, that's strike three. Okay, I don't well, know why we're not swinging at that, yeah, buddy. Yeah, Kevin Kiermaier, that was just a rough at that altogether, man. Not necessarily <laughs> what you want to see. Yeah. Dude, the gaming free. Where is this what, money going? Whoa! Another $10 Where dono. Is this, what do you do for a living, and how do I become a part of it, man? Because <laughs> this is crazy. Not, well, I appreciate you so appreciate much, man. You, bro. I think that one in the dirt was a ball. Uh, Yeah, you'd think You're that. right. You, yeah. You'd think. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Maybe we should get you to umpire the game, man. You're probably better than what, what we currently have going on. Like, it's just complete, it's just totally brutal. And I think that as technology gets better and as social media has become more prevalent and you're getting these pages coming out showing people how bad the umpire is, yeah. it's a dying industry, man. It's one of those things where, like, as we've become more aware mm -hmm. of what's actually going on, like, you know, how can we stand by? Like, 20 years ago, you look at it and you go, I don't think that's a strike, or I don't think that's a ball, but you don't really have anything to back it up. Yeah, yeah. Now yeah, you we have, have the all technology. this shit to go, hey, dude, you just gave them two and a half runs. Right. You. Uh, so if for anyone wondering, Corey Blazer is the guy behind the dish. Corey Blazer. Right there. He's blazing He's it, bro. Blazing it's in the it, name. Dude. He's literally blazing it out there, okay? That's well, crazy. Well, can you review balls and strikes? You can't. And that's no. something that people have been talking about. Like, maybe they have a challenge system. You have only, I think, uh, I don't know the exact number, but they're testing it out where you can challenge, like, only three times a game, uh, and it, it will come up and it will review in, like, ten seconds. Rather than every single pitch, because that will take forever. It will take forever, yeah. yeah. And, like, let's face it, it, even if it clipped the zone a little bit, you're going to see it in the dugout if you're the yeah. eyes. Yeah. And you're just going to challenge everything if you think yeah. that happens. So, yeah. No. Yeah, it'd have to be three times a game. And you have to be strategic with it. Would be, yeah. would be kind of cool. It might add an element to the game. Oh yeah, right? I think you know runners in scoring position, a big big decision. You get called strike three, and you're like, nope, 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 nope. You know. Yeah, and and that would honestly, if I'm the umpires, I would like that because then people would stop hating me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because I make a bad call. Well, you can just cha you can challenge yep. me on it. Yep. It's gonna get reversed. No, no harm, no foul, right? Like yeah. in, in football, when you have a bad call, you review it. Oh, never mind. Put the flag up. It's no, it's nothing, right? Yeah. We don't have that here. We only have it when it comes to like people like on the bases. bases or oh, oh, that one's foul. foul. That one's foul. Okay, that one's foul. It was hooked deep though. Deep, deep, deep foul. 0-1 on Paredes. 0-1-1 hmm. right now on Isaac Paredes. Chris Bassett, 15 pitches in. Bottom of the second. Paredes, 840 OPS last year. Really solid. Shout out to Eton with the dono. Let's go. Pointing arrows on all these MVPs right now. Here's the 0 one pitch for Chris Bassett. Gets there. Wow. <laughs> right down the That's middle. That's an FU fastball. I've never seen one. Dude, this is why it's so great to have uh, Chris Bass on the scene with all these different pitch types. You can get away with a fastball down the middle every now and then because they're expecting junk. Yeah. And then they see that and they think it's going to drop. Uh-uh. That's right down the middle. Yeah, it's tough to adjust, man. It's really tough to adjust. 0-2, 1-2 now. That one goes high. Bottom of the second. On, uh, Chris. On, uh, Chris. Toronto Blue Jays. I liked their first inning of work at the sticks, just didn't get any results because the ump. Second inning, not as good. But Chris Bassett looking lights out so far. One and two, that one is going to be outside. outside. Would have been Way called outside. a strike if this was against the Toronto Blue Jays. Just saying. Not bitter, just saying. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. W's for Eton right there with another donut. Yeah, yeah. Got Toss him up. It up right yeah, there. yeah, yeah. Umpire is, in fact, terrible. 2-2. Two, two. That's a big yeah. strikeout. And Chris Bassett has struck out the first four batters of the game. Is this guy locked in or what? Oh, my gosh. You, you know what? Chris Bassett was talking all offseason. be like, I'm not worried about this team being bad at all because our pitching is one of the best in the game. Can you imagine if this guy took offense 
the people saying we're going to be bad. And it's like, you know what? Here's a 1.5 ERA this season. I hope everyone does. You know? <laughs> right? I hope everyone takes offense and just like puts up. <laughs> The pitching staff, you can't say this for every team. You can't. Oh, wow. That's gross. Wow. Just oh, drops was. one in. A curve right there. Oh. You know, if you're Palacios, you're like, what the hell am I supposed to do with that? I can't prep for that. Gets a gets a get me over curve for strike one. But you can't say this for a lot of teams. This team does have the potential mm -hmm. to be the best pitching rotation yeah. in all of baseball. There's Absolutely. only a handful of squads that you can look at and be like, oh, okay, that team's yeah. got the potential. Can they do this it? Is the you team. know, yeah. we gotta see, but Looks Let's good see. so far. Chris Bassett, one on one in Palacios. Looks like we might be going inside. We go low. We clip the bottom part. We're not getting the call. We're not getting the call there. Okay, so <laughs> if I'm right now, my evaluation is this zone is wide, but not very vertically big. It's yeah, just wide. I agree. But also, we got a wide, a uh, high call too. We got a really high call too. He's just, I think he's just on one. I think he's just on he's one. He's on dude. the hallucinogens <laughs> yet again, everybody. Two and two right now on Palacios. I love how pissed off Chris Bassett looks. Yeah, I, I know. I love how pissed off he looks. <laughs> but he's so calm about it. He's probably like in his brain. He's like, oh. <laughs> Here we go. Two and two. Chris Bassett. Can we get the punchy? We don't get the call on the inside part. Pass. Yeah. Uh, Pass is so cheesy. He man. is, dude. He's not happy about that. High or oh. higher inside. Okay. 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 Yeah. That's how, he, that's how he gets through it. Okay, let me know where yeah, it like is. Yeah, you can tell. It's like the only reason he's asking that is just to tell the umpire. Like, yeah, I disappeared. Where did that right miss? There. Yeah. <laughs> that one fouled away. We got a battle going right here with, between Chris Bassett and Palacios. He's Angel Hernandez 2.0. Angel, look, Angel gets a terrible rap because he is awful. He's like one of the worst. The fact of the matter is. He's just like the poster boy yeah. for a terrible for a epidemic lot. in the sport, you know? <laughs> Ooh, we missed really inside. That's that going to be four. a ball, yeah. Uh, um, and it's too bad because there are actually some really good umpires at life. Like, there's been some guys that I've watched umpire the game, and I'm like, this is a perfect umpire game. They miss a couple calls, but it's not blasphemous. Mm -hmm. It's typically never in key moments. It goes for both sides. And yeah. those games I truly enjoy watching. I like the missed calls when it is minimal and when it's not a fucking mm -hmm. foot off the zone. These guys, this is horrible. you can't deal with it. This is horrible. It's, it's even... completely one-sided, and the calls are terrible. Like, like at least I, you know, some of these calls where it's like, okay, you have like, you're a, you're a complete ball off the zone, but this, the one we saw was like a foot off the zone. Like three baseballs could have fit between that and the zone. Yeah, agreed. Agreed. Bottom of the second. That one is going to be Ooh, hit. Foul. foul right there. Quick shout out to Bake Apple, Apple Jam. Mm, yummy. For the $5 <laughs> donor right there saying Bassett is great. What the F with this umpire? Great job, guys. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, Baked. The, the uh, uh, appreciation and support of this community is incredible, dude. Yeah. And we will never get over it, guys. You guys are truly the best. 0-1 right now on Harold Ramirez, former J-Killer. That one's way inside. 1-1. We have two inside pitches right there. I feel like that's got to be the weak spot on this guy. Yeah, and he we need a double he play. He swung at the first one. Yeah. So just go again, right? Keep doing it. Keep jamming. We've got to get that double play cooking. 1-1. Get out of this inning. Deals. That's a... <laughs> <laughs> a big hack at a looping curveball way outside the zone, and it's one and two. One and two. Again, shout out to Baked Apple Jam, who's just coming up right now on the screen for the dono. Love it. 334 of you guys in here. If you haven't already, guys, hit that like button. Smash the subscribe button. That one's chopped foul. The first base umpire, ste or uh, first base umpire, or first base coach, excuse me, steals it from Vladdy. Guys, hit that subscribe button. We're trying to get to 23.8K. We got to 23.7K yesterday with our opening day live stream. Can we get to the next level here? I think it's possible. One and two right now on Harold Ramirez. Chris Bassett at 30 pitches. Very efficient so far. He's looking for the ground ball. Can we get it? Get it. Here's the pitch. Outside, outside. Okay. That's a strike. If, again, yeah. I, I gotta shut up. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be on this the whole yeah. game now. See, it's, it's because like, when he called that strike call that was really bad against us, the catcher framed over that yeah, one. He's like exactly. reaching across and his also body. Too, that strike against us, it was coming in, so it was easier for the catcher to do that. That one's low. See, that's, in this kind of game, I remember when I played baseball, this is where I would literally tell my catcher, I'd be like, dude, set up outside. 
If you just set up on the outside part of the plate and you just catch it, even if it's a ball and like put it in, you'll get we'll get the call. Right. I would just tell them like let's let's do it. If we're going outside, put your whole body out there, mm -hmm. make it look like a strike. Full count, runners off. That one is going to be grounded. Could this be two? Oh, not no, going to be two. No. It's going to be one. With the runner in motion, you could not get two, even though it was a quick chopper to Bo Bichette. You just get the safe out at first. Two gone here with the runner at second. Jose Siri now up to the dish. He's batting 250. Got a hit yesterday. Runner at second base. Tight ball game so far. Pitching duel. Umpire MVP. Yeah, literally. Come on. Gotta love the devil rays. No one gonna get tossed way too early in the season to go that hard. Uh, you know, somebody could get tossed uh, maybe later in the game. I can oh, see that. Beautiful 70 mile per hour curveball in the zone for strike one. Here he's looking at the umpire going, really? <laughs> Dude, that's my favorite. That's my favorite pitch yeah. from Chris Bassett. Me too. Looping no curve. One, that's the thing. No one's looking for it. Nobody. That's there for a strike. There you go. You know, act like a good... Uh, Wait, did he not get that call? Did he not get that call? No way. No, he must have got that call. Oh, I oh, think he's okay. talking to himself. That's wild, dude. You're 0 <laughs> 2 right now. And you're pitching perfect. You're <laughs> pitching almost perfect at this point. But uh, he's unsatisfied with himself. Oh, that's strike three. Siri. Wow. Siri, that was bad, bro. You're what are Come you on, talking what are you to the umpire about? about? What are you talking to the umpire about? Those were in the zone, dude. Come on. Go look go, in the go, mirror. Go. Look in the mirror and figure yourself out. Because that was awful. I'm going to go get another drink right now, guys. It's, Thank it's you. Drink time. It's drink mind, time. If I, mind if you give me one too? Oh, yeah. <laughs> guys, 326 people in here, guys. Drop a like. Hit that subscribe button. So far, <laughs> entertaining game in a way that we didn't think. The umpire has stolen the show so far in this one. The Blue Jays, so they get, the bats got to steal the show right now. We're going to have our boys coming up. I believe it's going to be IKF, the J MVP, and then the real MVP, Kevin Beggio and George Springer coming up to the dish. Hey guys, for those who are new here, I want you guys to tell me what you think about Isaiah Connor Falefa. Yes, only one game, but tell me about what you think about the contract. What do you think about the signing? Open up. This is a safe space. I am the person who you'd want to open up to. I, I will listen to you if you're unsatisfied. I understand. But if you are high on IKF, let me know. Let's see what you guys are saying. Siri had to remind the ump how to, <laughs> how much they paid him. <laughs> it's like, dude, you're supposed to give me those. <laughs> IKF MVP. Okay, I IKF is God. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Glasscock. Yo, shut up, Boris, for watching our little skit there. <laughs> I want IKF God ASAP. You know what I mean? You know what? I think... IKF, this is how I see the story of IKF developing. He's going to get all the starts, as much starts as possible in April. But as soon as this dude is batting, which he will be batting, like a low 200 batting average, a low 600 OPS, dude is going to be now replaced by David Schneider. It, like You're going to start seeing the splits start to change in percentages. He won't be 80% at third base. He'll be like 50 you know, you're going to start seeing that. I, I'd bet money on it. Yeah, watch. IKF's going to hit a homer now. Just as I'm talking down to him. That is ball upstairs, 1-0. If he does, dude, I'm ready to be, to be shut up. I'm ready to eat my words. I just need to see it. 1-0. That's right there, strike one. That is strike. Thank you, Nick. All right, IKF. What are we going to do? 242 average last season. With a 646 OPS. Aaron Good Savale, year. 33 pitches. Oh, fouls off a middle middle Slide. curveball slider thing right there. One and two. Yeah, like, that's the type of pitch that you <laughs> wish that you could do more with, you know? Yeah, that's the type of pitch that Vladdy did damage on yesterday. Here's the one, two. And a big strike out there chasing that one. Case is a slider outside. Fifth strikeout for Aaron Savale. Yee! Wow, five strikeouts already. And it's mostly because the umpire's helping out. I know, out. I know, yeah. Well, he got two from the ump. Literally. Now we got the MVP. It's...
it's kind of not even a joke because he literally has the highest OPS on the team right now. One yeah. game, obviously, but dude's an MVP. It was a hell of a game. Ooh, uh, takes a not, hack there. We are, uh, we're, we're laid on that guy right there. 0-1 on Kevin Biggio with his 7-10 OPS. Last season, last season. Last Wait. season, last season. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. 0-1. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Way inside there. See, this is the kind of umpire that Kevin doesn't want. He does not want this umpire. He knows the zone better than him. Uh, Narrow Narco saying, I just came to this page and I'm going to be honest. The first thing I saw was someone making a remark in the comments about a glass cock. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. It'd be a weird thing to first see. Uh, one and two right now on Cavan Biggio. Savale, 38 pitches. Biggio batting 500. Yeah. Yeah, that's a shout out to a little skit we had for opening day, guys. Check it out if you want. And uh, use it to get out of work, but I guess it's kind of late now. That's in the dirt. Two and two. Ashley, Gate 14 boys think Biggio is the best hitter in the league. Can't even argue with them on that. Dude, I think Can't we... Argue. I mean, we literally have a graphic saying MVP Biggio, so I think we think he's also the best hitter in the league right now. Two and two right now on Kevin Biggio. Savale. Deals. Oh, that yeah. It's going to be... Uh, uh, I thought it might find a hole. It is going to be eaten up right there. Uh, and Biggio is retired. Two gone, everybody. And now George Springer. Who got a horrible call struck three against him. Springer went yard yesterday to get the boys on the board to tie up the ball game one to one. Come on, Springer. Let's go, baby. Springer home run. Wouldn't that be something? Wouldn't that be something, Martin? Two oh, days in a on. row? Deals. Oh. Whoa. Okay, we're late there. We're yeah, late there. 0 yeah. 1. He attacks those upper pitches. He wants them. Stick with your game plan. Pick your spot and, and swing, man. Come on, George. Let's go. 0-1-1 right now. Savale deals. Oh, yeah! No, no way! Come on, come on! No way! Let's go! Again! Again! Let's go, Springer Two Dingers! days in a row! That's my man. That's my man. I wanted more Springer Dingers, and I got more Springer Dingers. He is all the way back, folks. He's George here. Springer is here. Let's He's here. fucking go. Dude's on pace for 162 homers this season. That That's MVP. Oh, wow. And it's one to nothing, Blue Jays, guys. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Get the tweet out there. That's unreal, man. That's unreal. George Springer, my man. I wanted more slug, and there it is. Vladdy takes one for a strike. Come on, Daddy. Oh, I can't believe it. This is storybook right now. This is storybook. We are speaking it into the existence, like saying, hey, we want more power from George. We're getting it so far, Vladdy. That's inside, not called a strike. Wow. My God, just stick with your game, dude. I see his game. Just pull my pitch. I am pull so. My pitch. I'm just. I'm so over the moon right now, man. The fact that this guy and it's the same thing. He goes. He goes uh, first mm -hmm. time through the order. Mm -hmm. First time mm -hmm. through the order. Mm -hmm. We're learning. We're evaluating. We're in, we're getting an intake of information. Boom. Second time, fucking Boom. watch, dude. He goes. He's throwing those sliders over the plate. Like go hit him. Now we got a two one count on Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Who take? Oh, that's a ball three right there. Yo, another a dono from Atlanta who always donuts for the Springer Dingers. Let's go. Let's go. George Springer over the fence. This team's a wagon. Toronto Blue Jays 2024 World Series 162 and 0. Vladdy three and one. Great hitters count. Takes one ball four. That's my guy. That's my guy. We're getting on. We're passing the baton. It's Bobo go boom boom now. That's my guy. Wow. I am hype. I am hype. I am hype, man. Oh, this already feels like a better year. And I know that's over the, over exaggerating right now or overreacting. But I don't even care. It feels great. Bobachette. Two outs. Vladdy's at first. What can we do here, Bo? He fouls that one away. Has a good pass at that. Give me my hit, Bo. I need my hit. I need my hit. If you get my hit, I feel pretty good about my bet right now. Come on. Yep, bombs in the chat. Hunter Mapes, Roger Lambert. Let's go. Get the bombs going, everybody, for Bobo. Go boom boom. Oh, that is a good pitch right there. A little low, but I get it. I get it. 0 oh, 2. 0 oh, 2. This is where, I mean, this is where Bo thrives on two strikes. 
Look at a Bob Average hitter on two strikes. It's unreal. And he puts this one in play. Can we find some grass? No, we get caught by the right fielder right there. And the Blue Jays put up the first run of the game off of a George Springer dinger. You gotta love it, man. Springer dingers are back. Baseball's back. Blue Jays are back. We're back. Let's go. 391 people in here right wow. now. If you haven't already, smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. We're going live today. We're going live tomorrow, mm -hmm. and we're going live Sunday for the entire race series. I gotta cut that George Springer clip, guys, but mm -hmm. this team is a freaking wagon, folks. I love it. I love it. Let's go, guys. Okay, you guys let me know in the chat. Are we overreacting right now? Are you feeling the hype? What is the, what is the consensus right here? How are we feeling after that George Springer home run? I know it's just one nothing, <laughs> and but Bassett looks good. If we can get offense like this paired with the good pitching, I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, Will Green saying the facts. 386 people are watching. Should be 386 likes. Pump it up. We got 151 likes. That is dope. Let's go. You guys are the best for New Brunswick. Shout out Daniel. Let's go, man. I never doubted Springer, saying Laura Lee Z, our YouTube member. I never doubted, doubted him. I would say I was down on him a little, maybe not doubt, I, but I believe that he could have a bounce back year. So I never doubted that he couldn't do it again. I want to see Justin Turner get one. I agree, Big Nibbles. I absolutely agree. Yes, I'm not feeling the hype for the Rays right now, saying Giovanni. Mike F saying, ride the wave. 95 win season incoming, says Sam. You gotta love it. Look, if we get these, if we get, it's very simple, guys. If we get better offense, we get a top eight offense and a top eight pitching, we'll win 90 wins. We will win 90 games. You can put, you can bring that to the bank, cash it in, feel pretty good about it. Chris Bassett. That's a first pitch single. <laughs> It always happens, guys. Gas it up this team, and then momentum shifts. First runner on, nobody out. First runner on, nobody out. Great smack from Dinger, says our MVP, Baked Apple Jam. Kofi, with the, with the honesty here, saying, I definitely doubted him. <laughs> double play time, says Danielle. Let's get it cooking, guys. Let's get the double play. That's that guy's first base hit, by the way. I'm pretty sure. Congrats. Caballero, who got thrown out, if you guys remember, by Kirk. Oh, did he get hit in the hand? He got hit in the hand. And just like that, we've got runners on first and second. Caballero is feeling a little bit of pain. Ooh, oh good, oh good. We got a little bit of pushback here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit, hit him, hit, hit him, hit, hit him. I'll buy, I'll buy, I'll buy. BS, he swung. Yeah, I mean, still. No, he didn't really swing, but he brought his hands in. It, it happens to dirty, man. It happens to dirty. Oh, boy. Coming out of the game? No, he's going down to first. Okay, okay. Uh, Chris saying if the boys can stay healthy all round, the Jays definitely have a chance this season. Yeah, absolutely, man. The squad can bang. Pitching can pitch. Now we got Yandy Diaz right now. Nobody out with two on first and second. We don't get that call. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Bassett wanted that call because that call has been called against us. Want to know. That's a strike. Bottom left corner. Come on. Come on. We need to pitch here. We need to pitch well. We got to roll two, man. We got to roll two. Diaz is dangerous. You got to avoid him a little bit, but you got to attack him too. That's the problem. You got runners on. You can't, you got really nowhere to put him. That one's down the middle, and Yandi could not square it up. One and two. One and two. One and two. Triple play would be great, Jordan. 
Do you think Dalton Marshall can have a bounce back season asking CarMax? Yeah. I actually do think he's going to do better this year. Different. He's going to have a different kind of line, but better. Ooh, and Yanni doesn't offer at that big sweeping breaking ball. Jeez, he's got so many pitches. I don't even know what that is. I'm going to guess a sweeper. Two and two. Come on, Bassett. Come on. Get this guy. I need it. Okay, we're stepping off here. We're stepping off. I guess he didn't like his pitch. He didn't like the pitch. Pick your pitch. Here we go. Two and two. Big moment here in this Blue Jays game. In the third. Deals. Way inside. We missed. Three and two. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Try not to look at the chat right now, everybody. Because if I look at the chat, I might get some spoilers. Because we are just a tad bit behind. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Full count. Full count. Come on, Chris. This is what good pitchers do. Get out the good hitters. And he fouls one away. 87 right there. That was a challenge. Ugh, 44 pitches for Chris Bassett. Not bad. Also got to record some outs right here. We got 352 people in this chat right now. Guys, if you haven't already, hit that like, smash that subscribe button. We're in a big moment right now in this game with two on. And that's a chopper left side. Bobby Shell bobbles it. Shovels the second. Safe. And then throws the first and he's safe. I thought he, I thought he might have got him at second. I thought he might have got him at second. I thought he might have got him at second. Are we going to look at this? The, the score? Are we going to challenge it? We're not challenging it, it looks like. We're not challenging it. Wow. Now the bases are loaded with nobody out. A bobble by Bo, but shit, that's got to be an error. That's got to be an error by Bo. Oh, yeah, he was safe. He was safe. He was safe. No, Buck, I wouldn't have looked at that. He looked pretty safe. You would have lost that challenge. You would have lost that challenge. Okay, base is loaded. That one's ripped down the line foul. I have Brandon Lau in a fantasy league, and he is my lineup today, but I do not want this. I do not want this. Brandon Lau, 0 for 1 on the day. 0 and 1 in this count. Toronto Blue Jays have the one-run lead, but the Rays are threatening here at the bottom of third. That one misses down and low. Ball, one and one. Yeah, he's safe. He's safe, guys. We don't need to look at this anymore. That was an error, my man. One and one. That one's drilled deep, and that is gone. Grand slam. And just like that, the Tampa Bay Rays are up 4-1. to one. Still no outs here in the third. Brandon Lau clears the bases with a grand slam. Wow. 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 Wow, 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 wow. Not a good, not a good start here in the third. Wow. 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 Oh, wow, wow, wow. I said I didn't want it for my fantasy team. My fantasy team is very happy. I am not. Now Rosarina's up. That's right there, strike one. Wow. He took, wow, he took Bassett deep. That was right there, middle of the plate. That is in the middle of the plate, Bassett. That's a good pitch right there. Rosarina swings 0-2. Still nobody out here in the third. That was right down the middle, man. That was right down the middle. And what a crack of the bat. Uh... Well, we got work to do, boys. Chopper up the middle. That's going to be a base hit. Biggio couldn't. It was a tough play to make. And now we got another runner on with nobody out. Jesus. Oh, Bassett does not suck, guys. Let's not overreact. 
He had a bad outing his first time around last year, if you guys remember. Wow. I'm in pain. And now we're having a mound visit from Pete Walker. I'm in pain. I'm in pain, I'm in pain, I'm in pain. We have the Yankee fans are chirping us right now. Hey, look, the game is not over. The game is not over at all, everybody. We, it wasn't going to be an easy road to get this victory. It wasn't going to be an easy road. Oh, no, no. We knew it was going to be a battle. Blue Jays offense, if we're believing in it, we can bang. We can bang. We need to have a double play here, man. We got 355 people watching right now. We're just tuning in. Chris Bassett gave up a cookie to Brandon Lau for the Grand Salami. That's in there for a strike against Isaac Paredes. We got one on, nobody out still. Four runs have already come in in this inning. And it's... It's, it's sad. 0-1. We don't get that call, even though Savali's gotten that call all game long. 101. Game is not over, guys. Still lots of game left. Lots of game left. That's outside. 2 and 1. Come on, guys. I, want to, I don't like this inning. I want to get the hell out of here. I want to get the hell out of here. 2-1. Pick off by Chris Bassett. Oh, God. Wow. Yeah, you missed a whole lot. <laughs> you missed a whole lot going on right now. Chris Bassett's been missing middle, middle a lot. That one misses there, three and one. So I hear that things aren't going as uh, as well as they were when I left. Um, nope. Not a single out in the inning either. Four runs have come in. Wow. Pass it. What are we gonna do, man? Three and one right now on Paredes. This game could get out of hand oh, quick. That one is gonna wow. be. Are we gonna make the play? Make the play somehow. Make the play. Let's Thank go, okay, Varshow! Colton Varshow making baseball plays like he does. Wow, and making a great throw, even though he didn't really need to. But great play. Great play. Okay, one gone. One gone. No more Schmitz. Yeah, no kidding. You drinking beer? Yes, we are, everybody. Might need it to I get through this it. one. Bottom of the third right now. Tampa Bay Rays up 4-1. to one. Uh, I just posted out our reaction on our TikTok and on our Instagram to that George Springer home run. So if you guys want to relive that, then go follow us on there. <sighs> Bottom of the third. Good tracking there also by Dalton Varsho. It's a tough ball to track in the Tropicana field. The roof. That's a strike there to Palacios. Owen one Pass it at 57 pitches right now. Look, we were talking about the bullpen getting used. This might be yep. one of those games. Yep, yep, yep. You might see if things aren't going well. Which we're not. <laughs> Mitch what? If we need length. You might see him. I'm not thinking about that right now. I want the boys to come out swinging here in the top of the fourth. Chris Bassett. Lacios. One and one. He deals. Chopper. Bassett right to Chris out. Bassett. Bang. This could be two. Good catch there okay. by Bichette. And okay. we're out of the inning. Look, we're still All in right. this game. We're still in this ball game, everybody. Yes, we are. It's going to be difficult, but we are still in this game. Chris Bassett, definitely not the best inning of work right there, guys. Gives up three hits. Gives up a grand salami. Not what you want to see. We're in the hole. But, but again, you know, if this is the 2021 offense that we remember, we break out of this hole. We get out of this thing no problem, folks. We bounce back. We tie this game up. You know, we, we rally. So we're going to need it. We are going to need it. Nick, get the paddle out. I'm going to wait a little bit. I do want to get the paddle out soon. I'm going to wait just a little bit here. If I see them start to get alive, then I'm going to get the paddle out. I'm going to get the paddle out for sure. But let's see how they walk into this inning, folks. Do they have fight in them? Maybe they do, maybe they're not. Uh, 341 people watching right now. If you haven't already done so, please make sure to hit the like and smash the subscribe button, everyone. We will 
live through this pain with all of you. We will weather this storm together, guys. We will do it. This is a bullpen game. It might be at this point, guys. It, it very well might be at this point, just seeing everything that's went down. Signal sucks and Sugarbush got... Okay, see you later, Atlanta. If George Springer homers again, we'll let you know. If he homers again, we will let you know. Ugh. It's tough, man, because I was on that, like, I was literally on such a high of this George Springer home run. Back to yeah, back days, like, same. you know, like, George Springer is popping off right now. Chris Bassett's dealing. And then just like that, that's baseball, guys. But baseball can be baseball, and we can bounce back. Because they had a great inning doesn't mean we can't. Ooh, I just realized they put up a three spot or four spot mm -hmm. for your bet. I know. Uh, yeah, yeah. we will be tough. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be tough now. Thanks, we'll put Chris. up a five spot. That's what we're going to need to do, man. Well, basically, <laughs> oh, he's pissed. if we want to win this game, like, you know, we might have to do something like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, let's see what the boys got. Who's going to be up for them? I think it's going to be Justin Turner. Turner. Yeah, Turner. it feels right. Second half of the lineup here. Yep. Turner, Varsho, and then Kirky. Zavale with the donkey donk. He comes with the pitch. Dump truck. God, what a butt he's got. I swear he never had that last year. What a no. On Turner. That's a ball. Thank you. Uh, did, the ump did you realize your mistakes, Ump? Did you realize those mistakes earlier? Thank you. 2 0 oh on Justin Turner. Volley deals. Fastball popped up and foul right behind home plate. Not catch up to that after seeing two saladas. Two and one. Come on. Get your first hit, Turner. Get your first hit, man. Get that monkey off your back. Get it off early. Oh, up at his head. High. Let go. Chill, dude. Chill. Don't you throw at Turner's head, even though I get to see that glorious yeah, head of hair. Lot, yeah, glorious head of hair. He's also got a shitload of pine tar in his back. Oh, yeah, yeah, he always does that. He always does that thing, like, with his bat. He'll put a bunch, and then he, like, sticks it to his, like, name. Does that, eh? Yeah. Did it with, like, all of his whole career. 3-1 uh, and one right now on Justin Turner. Savale deals. Okay. That's in okay. there. Okay. It wasn't you. That wasn't you. It's 3-1. and one. You, You're keyholing right now. At the end of the day, we're going to need you on to win this game anyway. So, yep. focus on getting on base, not the well, big knock. Who's going to be the hero for the Jays today? Stay Green nice team. and patient. Yep. Nice and patient. Yep. Oh. Come on. I got some air, but it's going to be caught uh, in left caught. field. You know what? Credit to Savali. There was a lot of filthy movement on that one. Mm -hmm. That one really, really moved. Yeah, and 3 2. It's uh, pretty ballsy, you know? A lot of pitchers do that nowadays. 3 2, breaking balls. Get the hitter off balance just a little bit. All right, guys. There's one gone in the bottom <sighs> of the, or top of the, top of the fourth, excuse me. Top mm -hmm. of the fourth is where we're at right now. Dalton Varsho now up to the dish. Want to see some contributions for him? Come on. Cavale. Oh, he's going for a butt, and he pops it up foul. I like it. I like it. Why Small not? ball approach. If he sees that he can get it, yeah. then go crazy, dude. Why not? Draw in that wild. runner from, or draw in the uh, defender from third. Love it. Donna, hey, everyone. I'm late today. No worries. Don't Welcome worry. in. 0-1 right now on Dalton Marshall. Blue Jays are losing currently 4-1. to one. Game still within reach, mm -hmm. but we can't be necessarily giving up a whole bunch more. Mm -hmm. We got to be getting a little bit back here. I want to get... You know, we don't have to have the big inning, but we can chip, chip away. Yeah. Got to get back, man. One and one right now on Dalton Varsho. Aaron Savali. Dios. Oh, don't swing, swing at that, man. Miss. Don't swing at that. Oof. That you can't swing at. You're not swinging at that, Varsho. Even though they called that a strike against you before. Can't do it. One and two. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. Base hit. First right. hit, first hit for the season there for Dalton Marshall. Dalton Marshall gets his name in the staff sheet. Now you got the captain coming up. Next. Got it to 82 Derek who just subscribed to W's in the chat for 82 Derek guys. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Captain Kirk right now coming up, runner at first base. This mm -hmm. is where this is a situation where 
you know, I'm, I'm interested in mm -hmm. seeing Dalton Varsho potentially take a yes. run. Yes, yes. I absolutely agree with that. Alloway, are we going to stay out, in play? Get out, 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 get out. Oh he makes my the catch. God! Wow! And Dalton tags up. At a boy. Okay. okay. I mean, somewhat of a productive out. Yeah. That's wow. you know what? That's tough for Kirk, man. Like yeah. that's like he fouled that one yeah. off, and it that was a great play by Palacios. Actually, wow. that was crazy that he that got there. That was a great play. All right. Kevin Kiermaier's up. Can we come up clutch like we did yesterday? He had an RBI single with two outs in last night's game. Yeah, look at that, man. Yeah, really good range right oh. there. And he may, yeah, somehow Ouch. makes the catch. Look at this. I mean, hats yeah. off. Hats yeah. off to the Great guy. Play. Hats off to oh. the guy. Look at that throw, too. <laughs> Pretty good. All right, two gone, top of the fourth. Kevin Kiermaier, can we come up clutch, buddy? Come on. Give us something here. Give us something here. So, all A. All the way to the high fastball. Yeah, Kiermaier. What type of Kevin Kiermaier are we mm -hmm. going to see in 2024? Is it a guy that we can count on at the dish? I know we can count on him in the outfield. This is Kevin Kiermaier out here, you know? Yeah. Can we count him in at the dish? 0-1 right now. You want to hit for more power. I just need you to hit a single right now, Kevin Kiermaier. Way high, way high. 1-1. Yep. Hit a single, you know, make it, make it 4-2. to two. And you know what? Like, if, if the, that does, if that run does come home with a single... Good tag up there by Varsho. Oh, yeah. I Very mean, good. you, you got to credit Varsho mm -hmm. with a lot of this inning if that scores. Yeah. Single, t you know, stolen base or uh, yeah, tag, tag up stolen base. One and two. Fouled off a of pitch inside off the plate. 330 people watching right now, everybody. We got a runner at second base. One and two is the count. Two outs. Blue Jays playing from behind. Mm -hmm. Not where you want to be against the Tampa Bay Rays because then you're going to see their good bullpen guys. Mm -hmm. And that's always very difficult. And they got a lot of them. They didn't come out yesterday. Here's the one, too. Here, Meyer. Find a hole. Ah, oh, oh, shit. That's, that's, that's grounded. And it will be Damn. three outs. Damn. Okay, we had a runner in scoring position. Could have come through there at that one at bat. Chris Bassett back on the mound. Come on. Yeah. How many more innings can we get from you, buddy? And can they be productive, okay? You, you let it slip away from you. You let it slip away mm. from you. Can we, can we find it again? I think he, let's see how many pitches he's got right now. It's got to be kind of up there. That was really... I'm guessing 65. Is that 65? I'm guessing 65. I'm guessing 65. He is at... Uh, he's at 59. Okay. All right. You know, through three, it's obviously up there, but he did get beat up. So, mm. can you give, us, give me five? You give me five? Yeah. You said that on the Blue Jays Today Show. If one gives you six, the other gives you five, you're good with that to start yeah, the year. It, it, the problem is I was hoping that it wouldn't be five and four earned. Yeah, yeah that's, yeah, that's uh, the problem. That is the but problem. you still need the innings. That's the thing. You do. You, you do, do need, need the, the innings. innings. Right? The game's not over, and uh, you know there's still a chance to win this thing. So. Got 307 people in here, guys. Hit that like button. Stay here, guys, because you want to see the big comeback. You got to love it. When the big comeback happens, you'll be like, I was here. I was here the whole way. That's what y'all are saying right now in the chat. I think two more hits without an out, and we, I'd pull them. Uh, I would probably get someone cooking at that point. Because, again, like, in the full 162 of the year, you're not, it's, not, it's different. If it's playoff baseball, sure, get rid of him. But you got to get innings with an injured bullpen. That's, that is a little bit more important right now than having potentially a scored extra run here in game two of the whole season. You want to get a little bit more length because you want to win. You don't, if this game's already going to lose, you want to win tomorrow. You want to win Sunday. And you want to save your bullpen as much as possible so the innings are more valuable right now. Shout out to Men Air with the subscription. Shout out to you. That guy's got wicked hair. That's right down the middle, 91 for strike one. That's where Chris Bassett's been living. It's almost been, uh, no, a little too much down the middle of this, play, uh, this game. 0-1 on Ramirez. That's a good spot. 0-2, good, good pitch right there. Come on, Bassett. Have a clean inning here, buddy. Clean inning. Bassett deals. Yeah, yeah, wasted that one right there. A sweeper. That's what it is, yep. Yeah. 
Yeah, that sweeper is like sweeping a lot. Today. It is. It is sweeping, <laughs> dude. It's sweeping. One, two, and there it is again. <laughs> it's sweeping a lot. Chris Bassett, come on, man. You were down. You were up 0-2. Now you're now you're all tied up 2-2. Come on. Deals. And he gets the check swing. Bo Bichette with the play. Makes a good throw. You're gone. One gone. Good. Bottom part of the order. It's going to be quick work here, Chris Bassett. Hose, uh, Siri coming up right now. Yeah, this is a whole new thing. Friday Night Blue Jays Baseball. Presented by McCann. That's a, that's a new thing this year. I didn't see that last year. I like it. Look, I was, I'm always a fan of, like, making a night. Like, this is this night, you know? Like, we watch this night. Like, Saturday Night Hockey, Friday Night Baseball. This is a popped up No Man's Land, but there's Kiermaier. Kiermaier makes No Man's Land look like his land. Because he's fast. Lots of range. Two gone really quick. There we go. That's what we need. 65 pitches right now from Bassett. Two outs here in the bottom of the fourth. Mm. That's a swinging strike, late pitch right there. Yeah, they're talking about the new turf right now. Kiermaier says he loves it. Literally looking at it right now. <laughs> cool. Yeah, I mean, I, I got to, you know, play on it, but, uh, but I do love like it. That's hit to deep center field. Uh, Kiermaier's going to make the catch, be, though. Go. He makes it look easy. The best outfield in the league. Kevin Kiermaier with two outs right there. And Chris Bassett with a clean inning. I think that was 67. So he threw eight pitches there in the bottom of the fourth. That's how you bounce back, baby. Let's get the bats going, man. We got to get the bats going. Better inning. Agreed. Agreed. Same. Make Friday the event. And hey, baked apple uh, jam. First time I've seen you send in a super chat dono. Maybe you have a four. Correct me if I'm wrong. But hey, we're having Friday night events here at Blue Jays today. We're going live for you guys every single Friday night here on this channel. It just so happens we're going live for every single game in this opening weekend series. But we will be continuing that Friday night theme for the whole season. Maybe we should make an official, uh, like an official list of drinking game rules for Friday night. You know, yeah, so, right? If Friday like beers, it. you know, like this is we're always whipping out the drinks on yeah. Friday night. Like, <laughs> I like these it. Are the rules, you know. I like it. I like it. I like it. You know, I like giving little uh, little parts of our show. We have a new schedule for this year, guys. Because you know, for those who are OGs here and have been around for a while. Nick and I, we officially were able to quit our jobs with the support of you guys, the support of the Nation Network. We're doing this full time right now. So uh, we're having a new schedule this year. We're going to have Mondays and Fridays at noon. We have our Blue Jays Today show. We're going to have different kind of styles and like segments for each Blue Jays Today show. We're going to be creating it throughout the year. And then Wednesday, like we said, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, live play-by-plays. And of course, video rooms throughout the week. And maybe some special guest interviews as well. Uh, sprinkled out through that in skits. So you guys, subscribe if you haven't already. We have lots of content. If you enjoy Blue Jays content and news and updates, subscribe to Blue Jays today. You found your community, man. It is truly the best place. It's the best. Totally unbiased. It's the best. We're going to have a new set, too, for those who are OGs. We have some like new set designs and stuff coming in, so stay tuned for all that. Ooh, Aaron like... Savali on IKF. Come on, IKF. That one's low. Come on, man. Yo, did you see the uh, the response from uh, from our main our main guy uh, Ryan? Yelled us. Oh, I did not. God, I did not great. see that. The best. I one and zero right now on Isaiah Connor Falafa deals. That one's gonna be high right there. Two and zero. For those of you who tuned into our show that we had today, mm. oh. we made a very special shout out to two incredible individuals. I don't know if they watch the live play by plays, oh. but if they do, again, I'm shouting you out. Uh, because it did mean a lot to us. Isaiah Connor Falafa with his first hit of the sport. Yeah! Oh, Isaiah Connor Falafa gets his name on the board! <laughs> MVP, baby! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I'm reading it right now. That's incredible. Keep going. Uh, but either way, man, uh, so there's these people. They're, they're out there in California. Mm. Uh, Ryan takes the time out of his day to, to message us this picture of him and his daughter, 10-year-old daughter, 
Aubrey. Shout out to Aubrey. She's mm -hmm. lovely. I don't know. Who, I've never met her personally, but she looks lovely. Mm -hmm. um, they, they got their own Blue Jays Today t-shirts that they custom made. It's not even from our shop. They made it themselves. They listen to us on the regular. Uh, they sent that photo and said how much they appreciated mm. it. Obviously, we had to share it. We had to show yeah, up. Yeah, that was off awesome, the man. Uh, and, uh, and we'll be sending them some free merch. So I could I could flash it up right here if you want. One and one right now on Kevin Biggio. Uh, but either way, uh, yeah, uh, just great great community building stuff right there. Uh, it, it truly is the best. If you guys have any any experiences like that and you want to send it to us, let us know. Maybe we'll showcase you on the show. Yeah, literally. Right here, guys. Like this is the shirts, man. That's super cool. Like take a look at that, guys. That is super cool. No, it's the best. You know? It's, uh, it's truly the best, and it, it made my day to see that. Yeah. And I'm happy that it made their day as well to, to yeah. hear from us. Yeah. Two and one right now on MVP Vigio. Here we go. That's inside. What a take, man. This guy's unreal. <laughs> this guy's unreal. Come on, get a walk. Get on, baby. Get on. Continue. Pass the baton. Dude, if you have IKF setting the table, we gotta have a big inning. Oh yeah, it, it's a must win if IKF stand <laughs> on, you know. That's the thing, like that's like free money, you know. Oh whoa, weird, weird the one right there. Sports from the that kind of just glitched. Yeah. But that's literally like house money. Yeah, you know, yeah. it's like hey, I got oh I got a free bet. <laughs> yeah. yeah, full count right now on Kevin Biggio. If you can get on, do you know who is up next? Oh yeah. Do you know who oh, is yeah. up next? The goddamn wagon, George Springer. Find a way, Kevin. Find a way. Three, Deals. two. Oh, Kevin. Damn it. Kevin. Damn it. I really thought you were going to do it there, man. Oh, Kevin. I really, really, really thought that he that's was going to do it That's the one Achilles heel of Kevin. He's too good at knowing the strikes. So he's like, man, that's about a 70% chance. Oh, that was no, damn no. It. He got frozen on a slider right there. That's that's damn I want to help. It, damn that's okay. It. I really thought he was going to do it right there. Hey, big shout out to Blue Yays with the Super Chat Dono. Let's go. I'm really happy for you guys. Glad. You could jump into a full time. Happy Friday. Let's go, Jays. Blue Jays. Blue Jays. Shout out to Blue Jays right there, man. Thank you so much. You are on the wall of MVPs. 0 oh, 1 right now on George Springer. Somali at 75 pitches. I guess at the very least you can say that we're working them, but it doesn't matter because their bullpen's probably yeah. better than this guy. George Springer's uh, going to hit that one. That's going to be two. 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 End of the inning. Wow, Isaiah wow. Connor left and finds himself on base. Wasted. And, uh, and we cannot do anything with it. At the very least, it's gonna go Bo. It's gonna or it's gonna go right. Dad. Yeah. Bo, Turner. Justin Turner. All right, guys. We got Chris Bassett coming out. We're also halfway through the game, everybody. So now, if you're an OG, you know. Time for a quick shout out to the sponsor of the live play-by-play. -play. Whoa! Time for your daily Betway breather. A quick reminder that the best place to bet is on Betway. Must be 19 years of age or older to play in collaboration with iGaming Ontario. Please bet responsibly now. Back to the content. Shout out to Betway, everybody, for being absolutely phenomenal, mm -hmm. guys. Uh, I hate to admit it, but I probably would bet on the Tampa Bay Rays at this point of the game if yeah. I could. Yeah, um, yeah it's tough. They're going <laughs> to they're they're have their, bull, their shutdown bullpen. They are. Just finishing us they off. They are yeah. right now, yeah. yeah. Got a question in there from somebody saying, are you guys Christian? I'm personally not Christian. And my family was never a religious family. Mm -hmm. uh, but I mean, no, you know, no disrespect to anybody who is Christian or Catholic or whatever, you know, it is that you support and believe in. I mean, like, we're, uh, right. I've always been in the mindset where it's like, hey, dude, like, whatever gets Do you through you. the day. Whatever Do gets you through you, the day. Do you, man. Yeah. You know, what gets me through the day is this seltzer right here, <laughs> you know, and, like, and watching yeah. baseball. So this, this is my religion. Yeah. I am a baseball fan. <laughs> oh, dude, I, whenever I watch this commercial, I cannot get over how awkward <laughs> Jose Barrios looks like. like you look at his eyeballs, man. Yeah. Like, there's, there, it's a, it is a sad, sad man. <laughs> uh, yeah, also, shout out to Aid who says, you guys are my favorite YouTubers. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Shout out to you, my friend. All right, everybody. We are heading into the second half of this ball game. We are trailing by three. It's going to be some work for these Toronto Blue Jays to claw themselves back into this game. I believe it. I think they can do it. But, but we need yeah, to be able to gotta, step up. It's got to be soon, especially like you just highlighted. Next inning, you have the big boys. So you, you're hoping for one, maybe two out of that next inning to have a chance to like get one more in. That would be good. Chris Bassett out here for the bottom of the fifth. Gets a strike right there inside part of the plate. 0-1. Caballero. You're going to have a number nine hitter. Then it's going to be one and two. Yanni Diaz and Brandon Lau, who had that grand slam. Come on. Makina. 
screen. That's fouled away, 0-2. Lord Tulum saying, watching from the UK, good to have baseball back. Well, if you're watching from the UK, you must have heard of Sophie. Oh, yeah. Sophie is like the, uh, I don't know, I don't want to say token, because clearly she's not the only one, but like, you know, like, like the known UK mm -hmm. uh, fan. We love her. We mm -hmm. love her over here. The best. Owen two right now on Caballero. That one's gonna be <sighs> damn. Foul, okay, foul, foul. that's you know it's Close. just a good piece of hitting right there yeah. for Caballero to even get his bat to that. Yeah, stay alive. Yeah. That would have been dangerous if it went down the line too. Yeah, that could have been two right there. That could there. have been a double, yeah, yeah, if it found grass, for sure. It's close. For sure it could have. So what are you going to do now, Bassett? He fouled away that high fastball, a little bit late on it. You either go inside with the fastball, or you do that sweeping curve a little bit more outside. He was willing to chase it, so you got two options right here. Where's he going to go? He's going to go outside with the sweeper. Or a fastball, mm -hmm, chopper, mm -hmm. and there's Bo uh, Biggio, That's MVP excuse me. right there. That's Let's MVP. Go. Don't you dare compare that guy to Bo Bichette. He's miles better. <laughs> Yeah, Boba Shed so much Boba better. Boba wishes although, he's although, good. Man, the one thing is, like, Gavin does have two strikeouts this year, both looking. I mean, that's just how it's going to be. <laughs> it, you know what? It's a trade-off for the walks, <laughs> yeah, yeah. you know? You take some, you, you got to take some of the good and take some of the bad with Gavin Vigio, yeah. and that is going to happen, guys. Like, at the end of the day, I, I do hope and I... Honey, oh, fouls that one Jesus off. Christ. Is that going to be... No, we're going to run this out of room. This guy is so scary to me. Um, I do hope and believe in, you know, a bounce back from MVP Vigio, but if we're being realistic right now, a bounce back is a 750 OPS for him. Oh, and yeah. And I'd be so happy with that, but a 750 OPS guy certainly has his holes and will get his outs, mm -hmm, and that's mm -hmm. going to happen with mm -hmm, Gavin. It mm -hmm. is. Yeah, if he was perfect, he'd be a literal MVP. Legit. You know? That misses the zone. I wish we would have got it. We didn't Me get too. it. Shout out to Creamy Skippy with the subscription. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go. W's in the chat right now, guys. Again, the best fucking community on the internet right here. One and one right now on Yondi Diaz. Chris Bass at 73 pitches. I think there's a reality where he could go yeah. six. Yeah, absolutely. There's a reality. There you go. One and two. If you get some, if you get a quick three up, three down inning here, you go six. That that severely helps the bullpen. Absolutely. I think that you at least start him in the six. Yeah, Where, you I know, agree. Obviously, if, if he lets up a couple base runners here, that's a different I agree. story. John, but John Schneider knows the situation. You know, he knows he needs to get innings, and that one's a way outside yeah, that sweeper. Is pretty way outside. And also, if I'm Chris Bassett, like, God, I'd be pissed if he didn't let me continue. <laughs> uh, Rodeo says, "You guys on thirty second delay or normal frequency or no, normal latency? Excuse me. I need to know how to set my Sportsnet feed. So effectively, how it all works, man. And it's difficult. Um, you know, because you know we're on a slight delay on what we're watching on two and two right now. Fires that one is going to be ground. It should be an out. Boba come on, Shad. Bo, big long big... throw. Big. Oh, oh! Yandy does not come up with it, and Yandy's going oh! to two. And Yandy with a single. And the pain and an continues. Wow, is that it? A... Let's look where wonder, the throw was. I wonder if they're going to give him Let's another error. Let's look where the throw was. I think you do, man. I think it goes. Like, yeah, that's two errors now yeah, for Boba Shad. Because at the wow. very least, it should have been a yeah. single. Oh, but Guerrero. Wasn't it wasn't in between. It was, it was it tough. Was it was obviously very tough. But yeah, like, but see, we that's, the, that's the thing. Is like, that was a tough throw, too, to me. It was. It was tough across the board, but it shouldn't have been a double. It so, should have been to yeah. hold him to a single. So, someone's got to get the air, and it's going to be Boba Shett there. That's tough, Two man. errors for the guy. That is tough. Oof. Boba Shett on pace for 162 errors on the season. Literally. That's that going to be ripped. Ran to Guerrero. Come oh, on. find a way. Find a way. Oh, no. We don't. We don't. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, Yanni's held up a three. Oh, the ball. my God. Okay, so Vladdy just threw Bassett a bit too high from his ass, and we don't get the out. Bassett appreciates the effort oh. from Vladdy, and Lau gets on, and now oh. we have I just Randy. got PTSD from the Seattle Mariners game two years ago with all the, the defensive stuff that we did. Uh, see, it's like, again, another tough play. I know, I know. Like, and like, again, like, I can't, you know, you had to be perfect uh, to get it done. You had to be perfect to get it done. You did great to even keep it in the yeah. infield, but it's like... See, uh, th that's why I'm not, like, I, I, it's very different in a way from that t uh, the game two of the wild card. Is that, it, like, for this one, it's like, they're making the good plays that they're just not finishing. Just not finishing. Yeah, you, you, there's no finish right now. No finish. And now like, we, are in a, we are in a little bit of a, a jam. We're in a bit of a jam, everybody. We got a runner on first, runner on third... All of a sudden, and uh, and you're looking for the double play. You're looking for the double play, but, you know, we got to turn it if we get it. Yeah, you got to turn it. That'd be the perfect uh, perfect ball right now. One right up the middle again. Um, Randy does run good. 
see what and it's happens. also Randy does hit good too, so this is kind of a problem. Yeah. Not where you want to be right now, everybody. Game could get out of hand very quickly. Find a way to keep it tight. Find a way. I want to keep watching and be intimate with this game. Chris Holy Bassett right down the middle. Wow. He keeps doing that, oh my man. God. He keeps putting it down the middle. Look, I like that because I like when you're commanding the zone and telling hitters it's like you got to be on me. But let's not forget, your fastball's 92. Dude, that's what the, he literally that exact same pitch was the grand slam. Yeah. Like, like 0 and 1. That's great. That's, a that's what pitch. I'm talking yeah. about that's right a there. 0 and 2. Right there, you know? And that's ultimately mm. always going to be the difference between a guy who's got a 91, 92, and a guy who's got a 97, 98. Yeah, 98 <laughs> down the middle. You, you're you not can get swimming. away you with it. You can away get it. away with it. All right, two. this one we need. We got to get out here. Anyway, anyhow. Bum. Ground ball up the that's middle. perfect. Base oh, hits. no. Base hits. That's going to be a run. That's now 5-1 Tampa Bay. My God. And this one is getting away from us. This one is getting away from us. This one is getting away from us. The Tampa Bay Rays. The Tampa Bay Rays. They're coming out. They're swinging. They're coming out and they're swinging. This is the Tampa Bay Rays. We knew it was going to happen eventually, guys. They are a good offensive team. We knew it was going to happen. That one was also a pretty good hittable hit. Uh, pitch, excuse me. All right. Yuck, 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 yuck. Not the start you want here for Chris Bassett to begin the season. Now we got Paredes. One out, two on. Runners on first and second. That one misses low. Ball one. Yucky, yucky, yuck. Yucky, yucky, yuck. Paredes is 0 for 2. Ground ball would be great. We don't get that one there. 2 and 0 oh now. 2 and 0. Oh. 282 people in here. Let us know how you're feeling. Genesis Cabrera is warming up in the pen. Time to pitch the bad guys. That one's on the outside corner strike. At least if you pitch all the bad guys, you'll save all the good guys. For tomorrow. But we gotta come back. Gotta come back, man. Good one. That's a strike. There you go. Good paint. Two and two. Who's the J of the game going to be? Oh, you got Wes Parsons warming up. That's how you know. That's a, that's a, uh, a white flag yeah. if I've ever seen one. Henesis is for if we hold him here. Wes is for if we give up a big bop. Two and two. That's ripped foul. My God. I got Oh, Paredes. He was good last year. I did yeah. want him. I did want him. I know. When we were rumored to trade for him in the offseason, that would be the great third base for playing. My God. We imagine Paredes and we got Justin Turner in our lineup after Bichette goes Paredes or Turner Paredes. Like, that's messed up. That was fouled away. Like, that, that's wild. And instead of, uh, or, or, you know, and we do still have IKF, but now IKF is just your bench guy. He's a bench and guy. And you just, you know, cycle Amazing. in wherever you want. And, like, that's perfect. That's always what he should have been. Oh, yeah. He's not a starter. No. <laughs> He's not a starting player. Who well, thought he was a starting player? Uh, Ross, Atkins Atkins Ross Atkins did. Ross Atkins did. Not. That's shot foul. Like, it literally, I remember going into this offseason... I love how it's like a camp just catching strays and like he's not even. I think he's gonna continue to catch oh, strays yeah. until he's batting with an eight fifty. Yeah, so. yeah. But like literally going through this offseason, I remember looking at all the free agents and I remember uh, thinking like, oh, I can't the last guy I'd be one. Definitely don't want that guy. He's literally the last guy I'd want to sign in the entire free agent pool, and we signed him first. Two and two right now on Brady's deals. That one is yes. swung on and missed, and we do get a strikeout. It's much needed. God. Oh, I got a feeling. Where are we at in the pitch count? Where are we at in the pitch count? Oh, man, we needed to have a quick inning, and we just did not get that. 88. Yeah, this is probably it. Oh? Okay, no, no, we're good. We're good. I thought he was looking around. Like, no, oh, no, I think me. that you're, you're you going to finish give him, it, man. Yeah, like, let him finish. If this guy gets on, you're, yeah. done, you're done. Yeah, I agree. Done. This is your last batter. It's Richie Palacios, 0 for 1 with a walk in the second. Come on. Find a way. That's way high. Want to know? Come on. Damn. 
game is humbling me a little bit. <laughs> That's how baseball works. Yeah, man. yeah. <laughs> One and zero right now on Palacios. Bassett deals that one's in there. Ball two, missing. We are missing. Ninety pitches right now for Chris Bassett. This is the end. This is it. Two and zero. Ground ball. That's a there great pitch. Go. There you there go. There you go. Little sweeper back door, but yeah. it's such a back door it actually drifts over the heart of the play, like in the middle part of it. Low. Two and one. On Palacios, on Chris. Need you, Chris. Bassett has his stinkers every now and again. I agree. Yeah. It's going to happen. It will happen. Missed there, three and one. Yeah, I mean, th take a look at last year. He started off in St. Louis with a horrible start. It was really bad mm -hmm. in that game three. He gave up eight earned runs. It Fuck. was horrible. <laughs> yeah, it was horrible. Three and one on Richie. Come on. There you there go. There you go. Three and bit, two. A little bit of a grunt, a little angry grunt from Chris Bassett. Yeah. Come on, Chris. I finish want you off. to finish. Finish it off, man. Finish it off. Don't load the bases. That's the last thing we need right now. That is the last thing we need. Full count. Runners will be off. And way wow. outside, dude. Way outside. Wow. We load it up. Way outside. John Schneider, is he coming? I got a feeling he's coming. I feel like he's coming. He probably it. knows it too. Wow, he's giving, wow. Him another, giving him another chance. Wow, okay. 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 Trust in his guy. Um, oh, God. Wow. I would have uh, hooked him here. Yeah. Um, <laughs> All right, uh, look, I mean, maybe, dude, maybe he's really just waving the white flag. Like. You, you know what? Maybe, is there a lefty coming up next? Is this the classic, like, we're going to wait for Henesis to come in? Let's see. Uh, Siri is a, is he a lefty? Yeah, he is a lefty. That's why. That's why. Um, of the fifth. That's oh, and a little be, chopper. That's an out. This okay. should be it. Boom, okay. and we're out of the inning. Oh, my God. Chris Bassett stays. Got to be over now. Five earned runs, five innings. That's a nine. Four earned runs. Four runs. Four, there was oh, the there air. was an error? Okay, yeah. four earned runs, five innings. That is a not a good not start. Good. It's not, not a good, good start. Yeah. I got to run to the washroom real quick, guys. We'll be back. Get another drink. Oh, yeah, I will also need another drink, too. Yeah. Definitely going to need it. Definitely going to need it. What are you guys thinking with 292 of you guys in here? How are we feeling, everybody? I'm going to take a look at your comments right here. How do you not pull him here at what the F? Yeah, like I said, Boris, I think it's a classic Schneider. It's like, well, if we're going to put in Hennessy, let's have it against the lefty, Jose Siri. Wow. No oh, wait, Jose Series a righty. Okay, take that all back. No idea why. Take it all back. I take it all back. No idea why then. I don't know. Guys, we're going into the top of the six now. Blue Jays, we have four innings. That is 12 outs to try and get this game tied for... Uh, four runs we need. And we got our daddy who's going to be starting it all off. Let's go. Uh, I'm down. I'm not even going to lie here, everybody. I'm a little bit down with the boys. We got to get back. We got to get back, man. If we here, this is the road to getting back in this game. We need it. We need a few here. One is, it just doesn't feel like enough. Going 5-2 just does not feel like enough. We got to get multiple here. If we go two, we get two or three. I'm feeling good because you're going to need a second inning. To ask for four right here is a lot. But if we can get multiple runs, two, three, hell, screw it. Give me four. We're back, baby. More realistically, if we can go get two or three, I'd feel good. Vladdy, he's got a donk a donk of his own. That one's up there for a strike. 85 on the outside corner. Daniela asking for the spanking paddle. Is it time for the spanking paddle? Yeah. It's time for the spanking bottle. Vladdy takes another one for strike. 0 oh and 2. Oh, 
We'll get the graphic cooking. The volley. Deals. Vladdy drills that one. Come on, come on. No, it's going to be caught by the left fielder. Fuck. One gone. Fuck. Just like that. Thank you. Ugh. All right, guys. It's time for the magical spanking paddle. Y'all know when it's time for the magical spanking paddle, we got a spank, guys. And yesterday, the big spanking paddle actually drove in, I think, three runs. It did. It did. It was no, pretty it good. came up very clutch. It, ultimately, I know that we gave it to Jose Burroughs yesterday, but truly, we should have been considering the magical spank paddle <laughs> for the MVP. Bo Bichette now up to the dish. First pitch, outside, ball one. Oh, come on, Bo. Let's go, baby. Give me something. Give me my hit at least, man. Give me my hit. Give me my hit. Way outside. Ball two. Ball two. Bombs in the chat. Let's go. I love it. 2 0 right now on Bobo. It is time to go boom, boom. Catch it out front, Bo. Just like this, right? Bam. Bam. Catch it out front. Drive one over the wall. Get a homer. Here's the 2 0. He drives that one. Not enough air, though. That's going to be caught by the right fielder. Make a mistake. Center Make fielder? a mistake. Make a mistake. Center oh. fielder, yeah. I was hoping they'd run each other. That's me too, me too. Two outs really quick, guys. Just like I'm that. I'm not feeling good. <laughs> no, I'm not game. feeling good. Why is Aaron Savale doing this to us, man? We're the 2023 Toronto Blue Jays all over again. <laughs> oh, no. Yesterday was 2021. Today is 2023. Yeah. <laughs> Justin Turner. I'm going to up. Actually, if we're 2023, we'd have a better outing from Chris Bassett. That's true. Yeah, it'd be like three to one. Mm -hmm, you know? mm -hmm. I don't know. Come on, Turner. Get your first hit, man. Get your first hit. Everyone's got their first hit but you. Who is this pitcher? It's like they come out of nowhere. Well, Savali's been playing yeah. for a while. Like, he's been around the league. Um, oh. And ultimately, like last year, it, it, you know, like he, he mm. was... I think, was he on the Brewers last year? Uh, the Guardians. Guardians, mm -hmm. right. One of the other pitching fucking yeah, juggernauts. Yeah. yeah. Uh, when he was there, he was actually really good. And then he came to the Rays, and I think he wasn't very good when he got here. No, he was like at a five-year right? Yeah. Um, but, you know, now he's going to have that whole offseason to work mm -hmm. with them. So maybe he unlocks something. You never know. It also, guys, looks like it is going to be Wes Parsons, the guy who just made the roster starting or pitching oh, in this next Jesus. inning. This guy walks a lot of people. This game could get out on air. <laughs> yeah, it can. Two and one on Turner. That Come on. one is going to be No, out. another fly ball, man. Out. Oh, we are just, we are running into them right now. And just like that. What's going on? Wes Parsons is coming into this ball game. Mm -hmm. uh, Cody's saying Baltimore could be a problem for a long time. Are they playing right now? Are they doing great Let's shit? See. I mean, I... I, I could have told you that, you know, I, well, we did tell you that for a while, right? Like, they are going to be a big problem for a long time. Take a look around the league. The Yankees are playing the Astros. They just started bottom of the first. Uh, no score right now. Yeah. Uh, what else we got around? Boston, no, they're playing later. Looks like Baltimore's not playing tonight. Mm. Okay. Okay. But point taken, like, you're absolutely right, dude. Like, that team, that's going to sound terrible. That team is what we wanted the Toronto Blue Jays oh, to. Oh, yeah. But with even, with all of the true. prospects and with that, right, it's like that level of hype was the hype that we had in, you know, in 2021. And then it kind of slowly diminished. So, you know, from a Toronto Blue Jays standpoint, we got to hope that the Baltimore Orioles have something similar happen to them where it's like they have that massive season and, and then, then it slowly, you know, goes down. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but I wouldn't bet on it. <laughs> well, speaking of bets, Jet on. Life saying Bassett got that money on Tampa too. <laughs> little Otani action going on here, Bassett. Oh What's my going God. on? Can you they, imagine? Is that why you're throwing middle middle fastballs to Brandon Lau with the bases loaded? <laughs> wow. No, we're just kidding, guys. That Otani stuff's pretty crazy. I love how it's like you really haven't heard much from it after he gave his like press conference. Like, no, oh, no, let's that's forget. the thing. He gave his press conference, and now baseball started, so people mm -hmm. are on other shit, right? Mm -hmm. Like, the timing of it all worked out really well for Otani too, because it's like, well, the second the baseball starts, like we're gonna be on baseball. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, exactly. If Who this cares? came out in like the dead of January, oh, oh, we'd be talking season. about it for months. You know? Dude, like, think about how much we talked about that flight tracker. 
Oh, I know. Because yeah. nothing else was going on. That was it, right? Chris Bassett is yep. done, He's everybody. Done. That is the end of the day mm -hmm. for him. And now you got Wes Parsons coming in. Oh, boy. Let's see the numbers for Wes Parsons. A 4.55 ERA in the minors, 18 starts. Not a good K and walk ratio, but a big swing and a miss at a ball inside and off the plate by Jose Siri. At least Wes Parsons is going to get the 7 8 9. You know, if you're going to give Wes Parsons anything, even when we're down by four here in the six, give him the 7 8 9. 0 oh, 1. Fouled away. Okay, 0 oh, 2 count, Parsons. Oh, wow. Never would have thought this guy would have made the team, but he's literally just a band aid right now for Romano and for Eric Johnson. Yep. Oh, and do right now on West. Y'all's okay. is gonna be low. He missed right there. Missed. Blue Jays will come back. Says Skywalking. Get better. Bank on it, man. It could happen. And that one fouled away. Almost got him to swing and miss there, but good piece of wood by Jose Siri. Yeah, the Blue Jays will come back tomorrow to play game three, says Carl Anthony. <laughs> yeah, this is the favorite part of the of the stream where I start looking at the percentages from Baseball Savannah. What, uh, what are the chances the Blue Jays actually come back? I'm going to give us a 5% chance right now. Okay, 5% chance, says Nick. You guys let us know. I have not seen it yet. I'm going to go 6.6. .6. They get specific with it. Guys, let us know. Two and two on Jose Siri. That one's going to hit into play. Basic. That's a base knock. That's tough, man. That was actually like a pretty solid hit or uh, piece of pitching, I thought. You guys have one of the percentages. I've got the number right here. Got the number right here. Yeah, like he Ten. just touched it. 10%, 6.9%, 50% Scofi. Jeez, that's literally it'd be a tie game. <laughs> Uh, I'd have to say 10 if it weren't for Parsons. Uh, it is actually 4.4, everybody. Lower than all of us. Shout out to Nick Blaylock for getting pretty close. Yeah, no, you were the closest. 7% yeah, is Brian. It was, uh, it's 4.4. And yeah, base hit. Nobody out right here. That's Parsons. Nobody out. Come on. Come on, buddy. That one's upstairs. 1-0. Oh. oh, still didn't score. Come on, Parsons. What can you do, buddy? Bottom of the six. 1-0. and oh. I really feel nothing with that bitch. Like, what am I, what's he going to do? I don't know. Oh, we're running. And Kirk, did we get him? Uh, He's safe. I did feel like he did get there. Yeah, that's tough. You know what? That was actually Kirk's best, best throw. The best you know, yeah. like it was perfectly on target. And I mean, probably as good as you could have done in that situation. Yeah. He's fast. Great jump. Yeah. All right. Yeah. A very good jump. Yeah, a little bit of a short hop right there. Was his series steals the bag? Never All right, second. one and one, everybody. Happy Rays, they just don't stop. I love the green little belt there. Sadly, no double play anymore, Daniela. Mm -hmm. Runners advance to second. They might tack on a Ooh. couple more. We'll pick off. Boo's raining down. Uh. Wow. This is a tough one, guys. This is a tough one. One and one on the catcher. That's outside. Two and one. Come on, Wes. Just, uh, yeah, I thought he was running because Kirk looked like he was ready to come up and throw. Come on, Parsons. Find the zone, buddy. Give us some life. Give, Give us some, some momentum man. here. Pick off. Another pick off. Well, that's two, so he's... We might go now. Dude, I can't fucking wait for the eighth inning when we go crazy. <laughs> I'm ready wait, for man. it. I can't wait. This Parsons, man. Come on. If I'm serious, I'm, I'm going to try and steal. I'll try and steal. <laughs> He's looking back so much. He's going, yeah. He's going. 
and we're not gonna get him. Wow. Dude, wow. This guy's crazy. I, I know. Well, y you pick off twice. You, that's the free green light yeah. right there. Like, and Jose Siri goes around the bases. He's at third now with nobody, nobody out. Yeah, literally Buck's talking about it right now. Like, once you do it twice, like, okay, I'll go now. Thank you. That's what you're saying. And now we are after a single <laughs> in, a, in a position now with a sack fly. With three and one on Rortvet, so. There, there you, you go. go. This, Come is, on. this is a tough, this is a tough watch right now. Uh, it's a tough watch. I mean, Wes is facing dudes that are like, he's, you know, that are going to be the number three hitter in the lineups in like AAA. Yeah. You know? This is tough for Wes. Look, right I, here's the thing, man. I don't want to get on Wes Parsons too bad because, again, like. Look, he didn't ask for this. Well, yeah. I mean, he's, he likes it. <laughs> but, he, was, he was thrown into this situation. <laughs> uh, I mean, the guy is obviously Ooh. trying his best, but this is a hostile environment. Well, yeah, and, you get called to the show, and yeah. you're gonna get you're gonna get ripped on. And ultimately, let's be real. Ultimately, this game's not on him. This is, you know, <laughs> like it's. <laughs> Dude, I'm, I'm just I'm, I'm just yeah. I, I, know, I understand. Strays, like you know? people like, are gonna take it right now. We're down five to one, uh, and the team's not looking great <laughs> today. Made a couple defensive woes. Haven't been hitting great. The pitching wasn't phenomenal. Basically, everything that we were doing really good yesterday, we're not doing good no, anymore. No, no. So, well, it's, yeah, it's the, tough. Jay, the game right now is George Springer. Mm-hmm. You know? At least he had a nice Well, he's game. the one guy who actually was productive so far Oh, my today. God. And Gwes actually pumping the zone, but we can't get the out right now. Full count on Rortvat. I'm angry. I am angry. Come on, full count. Get out, Rort, vet. Jesus, this guy fouls off another one. This will be the 16th pitch for Parsons, and this is the second batter. My God. What in that bat from the catcher right here? Got 236 people in here, guys. If you're still here, hit that like button. Smash the subscribe button, guys. We're going live. The next two games of this series. We don't go anywhere. This guy fouls off another one. My God. This guy won't go home. Get out of here. Go back to the bench. Yeah. Yeah, Siri's actually putting in work against us this series. Like, he's Literally. doing well. Doing well for himself. And he's, like, clearly their steal guy over yeah. at Tampa. He's racked up oh. three stolen bases in two games. Yeah, that's quite a lot. Hey, for all those people who play fantasy baseball out there, not a bad shout. If you've got steals in your category league or something like that. Seriously, know, yeah. yeah. Like, I mean, clearly this guy, like, that's going to be this guy's role for the Tampa Bay Rays. I yeah. get on base and I steal. Full count right now on Rortvet. Still full count. My God, 18th pitch coming up. Steals. And ball four. We're going to walk him. Wow. That was a tough, that was a wow. tough one, Parsons. You really fought there. You did your best, but Jesus. And now we got the number nine hitter. Like, fuck, we walked Rort Vet? Yeah. Rort Vet. Yeah. Never heard of that guy. Before. It's just like, hey, look, we, it's not Wes Parson's fault that he doesn't have the stuff to get a, a guy out. Do like, we have access to the internet or, like, the, the page where you pull shit up here? Yeah. Can yeah. we see Rort Vet's stats? I'd really like to look at that. Rort Vet. I don't know how to fucking... Yeah, I don't even know how to spell it. Roar. That. What is he? Oh, oh and he he's bunts. in a bunt, and it goes just foul, foul. Thank foul. you, thank you. We need it. Um, this guy has a career negative 0 0.3 war and 157 at-bats with um, a OPS of 489. OPS plus of 36. Barely any ABs. I think he. Uh, wow. He's 26. We just walked that guy. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And now they're trying to bunt and uh, squeeze, a little squeeze play right here to get this guy home. Understandably so. I mean, you got no outs right now in this inning. You might as well just tack it on. That oh, one's going to be hit. Foul. Oh, and, and two. It's terrible, too, because after this, you're going to get Yandy Diaz. Yeah. You're going to get Yandy Diaz yeah, after this. I don't like that matchup. Oh, West Parsons versus no, Yandy no, Diaz. No, 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 no. no. Hell no, uh, man. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. This, this feels like a lot coming in here. 0-2. Oh, 
Fouls it off. Rodeo 2, uh, will you guys stream for tomorrow's game? So yep. le let's make it extremely clear again, guys. Tomorrow, so Saturday and on Sunday, we are going to be live doing exactly what we're doing right now. We're going right. to be doing it the whole weekend long. We're going to have a podcast coming out tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. Podcast coming out tomorrow morning. Oh, grab ball. This should be two. One. And he's, he's safe. safe. So we only get one, but the run comes one. in. We six to one. Another one. Six to one. Oof, that's terrible. Wow. That's all you can do. Like, you know, you, you, I, I agree with what Buck's saying. Like, you did your best. Yeah, yeah. And you actually, you know, like, you did it to the best of your ability, but that guy was just really fast. Yeah, that's it. I mean, you're, you got put in this situation. Like, you're pitching West Parsons. Like, you're down by four. You were down by four. You're here now. Gotta do what you gotta do. Six to one. Undy up now with one out. Oh. Whoa. That was Whoa. middle and Dude, slow. Dude, Yanni's probably like, really? Yeah. <laughs> like, he's, uh, he's here, I he's like, never okay. expect that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what yeah. I thought Throw it one. again. <laughs> yeah. All right, going to skip. Oh, and we'll foul off. They're really playing with Wes Parsons here. Wes Parsons. Uh, again, like you're right. I feel bad for him. Kind of deer in headlights right now. Yeah. You know, what are you gonna do? It's tough, dude. I mean, like this guy was thrown into this situation, and uh, you know, like at the end of the day, Yandy. We can all agree for sure. Yandy Diaz is oh, and he's stealing. Much superior. And ground ball. This is only gonna be one because he was off on the pitch. One out or two outs now. Okay. With a runner advancing to second. Okay. Brandon Lau up. We take that. <sighs> That's game, says Danielle. Listen, this was game in 2023. <laughs> <laughs> this is a different year, everyone. It's a different year. Oh, I feel like the guys are out there in the field. Their legs are getting all tired standing out there. I know, man. I know. Bottom of the six right now. Brandon Lowe. West Parsons deals. That one's in mm -hmm. there for a strike. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I did all the damage today. Oh, and one. And low. Wes Parsons. Dealing. That one misses. Well, 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 well. This is baseball, guys. Not everything's going to go the way that you expect it. 1-1. One one. Ooh. Oh, that, I don't think that's where he thought that pitch no, was going to No, that go. wasn't competitive. That just wasn't competitive, and that's tough. 2-1. <clears throat> I wonder who you put in next. I wonder if you go Mitch White. I'd go Mitch White and just go the rest of the game until the offense start, comes back. You're going to need it. You're going to need the guys. Big swing and a mess. Good. That's, that's probably his best, best pitch. That's the best pitch that he's thrown today. <laughs> yeah. The best pitch that he's thrown today. Yeah. Up and in. Get some swinging. Two two. Hey, he gets him to get strike him out. Again. Let's go. West Parsons with the K. We get through that inning. I'll be right back, y'all. You're gonna have Varsho. You're gonna have Captain. And you're going to have Kiermaier come up next. I don't know why. Maybe I'm wild. But I'm actually, like, not that down bad. Like, I feel like we still got a chance. I feel like we still got a chance. I'm buying into the narrative that we were talking about yesterday. Saying that this team is all the way back. Because it's possible. It's unlikely but it's possible, everybody. 231 people still watching right now, guys. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button and smash the subscribe button. And also, too, guys, go follow us on Twitter. The link to do so is at uh, pinned at the top of the chat right now. Follow us on Twitter. We're tweeting a lot more. Uh, and you can follow us on Instagram and TikTok, too. The link for that is in the description. I posted out a reaction to George Springer home run. And, yo, is George Springer all the way back? question mark is that like what we're thinking i can see it i like what i'm seeing i think we're doing well 
We have three innings to tack on some runs. That's right, Sky. We got three innings to tack on some runs. Yeah. And we do it. The drinks are getting to you. No, I'm just overly optimistic. I'm just overly optimistic right now. No re Look, there's no reason not to be, okay? If we lose this one, we lose this one. You know, we, we were projecting that we go 2-2 two and two in Tampa Bay anyways. I, would, I, I really did think we were going to win this one. But. Yeah. Hey, maybe we win tomorrow. You never know. And tomorrow, we're going to be featuring the Cooch's loose shirts, everybody. We got some, uh, again, we've got our merchandise uh, right here, y'all. The Cooch Lewis isn't actually on this graphic, but if you go to nationgear.ca slash Blue Jays today, link is in the description. You can see the Cooch's loose shirts. We're going to be featuring tomorrow, shouting it out, because uh, they're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. We were wearing some of this stuff yesterday. So check out our merchandise, everybody. And also, again, if you have merchandise, take a picture of you in it, wearing it, or, re or whatever, and uh, send it to us. We'd love to see it. All right, that's first pitch strike right there on Dalton. Varsho Davinsky is in for the Tampa Bay Rays. Varsho okay. one for two today. Deals. Looks like he's okay. got a quick approach. Not a whole lot of time wasted. I like that. Chris Davinsky, literally 100 okay. ERA plus, so a very wow. average, average player. Just an average guy that the Tampa Bay Rays will find a way to make a lead. But they do. Right. One and two. Makes sense. You know, you're in the seventh. You got a big lead. This feels like the right guy for them to pitch here pitch in this spot. One of your lower dudes that yeah. you know you, you want to try out and yeah. see what he's got. It's all about the bullpen management game, man. You, you save some guys for later. Oh, and Varsho golfs one, but not uh, deep enough. Not deep that enough. That feels like the story of today, man. Yeah. Not deep enough. Deep enough. One out except right your, there. Except if you're George Springer. Alondra Kirk. Now, what can you do, buddy? All right, Captain, let's get on the board. Let's get on the board. Yeah, that would be nice. That Wouldn't would be it? Nice. Yeah. Wouldn't it? To just have something going for us. Six to one is the score, guys. Top of the seventh. Davinsky fires. That one mm -hmm. is low mm -hmm. and outside. One and oh. Mm -hmm. Captain 0 for 2 right now in the game with the ground out and that foul out, that like first pitch pop out. The guy made a I great know, play on. That's tough for him, you what know. What can you like, do with that? That's just unlucky. Really. Good take there by the captain. The umpire has really quieted down since the first. Really quieted down. Like that was a yeah. strike back Opening in the first. Opening weekend nerves? Question mark. Yeah, I don't know. for real. Two and zero right now on Alejandro Davinsky fires. That That's will be called a strike. I get that one. I do get that one. Yeah, yeah. Come on, captain. He's got to stay within himself. He's not gonna be chasing those pitches. No, no. That wasn't that strikes. wasn't him anyways, man. That mm. wasn't him anyways. Davinsky. Give me the fastball middle of the plate. That's no, no, that's not a strike. That's not a strike. That's um, not a strike. That's not a strike. Back at him. That's bull. That's not a strike. Right, dude. Right when you said he quieted down. What yep, did he do? Of course. It's a little high again. Had a little, two little two. bump. Between should innings. be three and one. Good take. Thank you. Should, that should have been a walk. Yeah, I mean, should have been a walk. It, it, it pisses me off to no end. It pisses me off to <laughs> yeah, no I know. end. You know? I can't wait to see the umpire scorecard. I am looking forward to it. All right, here we go. Three, two. Ground ball. Oh, Give me an out. Give me an out. That's two gone. tough. That's tough, man. All right. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Blue Jays just don't have a whole lot of stuff cooking offensively no. right now. No. Not a whole lot cooking. We used it all yesterday. We got to come alive, guys. We got to come alive. Wow, no one predicted this literally in the pregame. <laughs> Everyone <laughs> predicted the Toronto Blue Jays would be smoking them. <laughs> That's a strike to Kevin Kiermaier. No bias at all in that. Yeah. 0-1-1 right now on KK. Oh, That's big a swing and a mess. 0-2. Oof. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> the momentum feels like it ain't here, everybody. It's uh, not here. It's it, stalled. It, 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 yeah, <laughs> it definitely did. Uh, one and two right now on Kevin Kiermaier. Wow, I was so hyped after that George Springer bomb. I was like, here we go again. We're going to smack all the homers. I know. Nope. Come on, guys. One, two. There you go. Good take. Let him come to you. Let him come to you. Don't be chasing. 
Les Parsons? Or was that Brian Servin? I have no idea. Good to. Oh, foul away. Well, I love the drive sober or get pulled over as behind. Just at Pete Walker next time, guys. <laughs> <laughs> the purpose of doing that. Two and two right now on KK. Devensky, 15 pitches, 6-1 to one is the score. Oh, That's God. A, no, I mean, like, again, I know you're being defensive, but yeah. you did foul it off, so good yeah, on you. Yeah, you had to foul it off. But, uh, you know, don't, let's not swing at that again. It's me, that would be the show. Like, I'm in swing mode. Just swinging at it. If I'm Devensky right now, I'm firing one back there again. Do it again, throw it again. You know? Do it. Oh, oh come on! He missed! And that's oh, right. Oh, off the glove of Siri. And Siri messes up, and con we need yes! that. That's got to be an error, though. That's it's a massive that's error. That's a massive error. That's literally error. in and out of the glove. Yeah. That's that's an error for sure. Let's check and see. Yeah. I'd bet money on that. Yep, that's an error. Yeah. Oh, Blue Jays committed three errors. I know, man. It's been rough today. The, defensively speaking, we haven't been Vladdy great. Or Bichette, they gave three to Bichette? Where was the third one? I thought the Vladdy had one. There was a third error. Um... Oh, I actually no. That. Okay, that's uh, apparently uh, um, Siri's claiming the light's got in his eyeball, but either way, we have a base runner. Yeah. No way Danny Burgers is coming. No way. Is that Danny Burgers? Yes! Yes! It's Danny Burgers! Oh, yes! This is what you like to see. This is going to change everything right here. This is gonna change everything. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Okay. God, you love it. Get the burgers in the chat. Daniel Castro or Daniela Castro with it. Let's go. Let's go. Thank God. Dude, what did I say yesterday? In a situation where you need uh, a lefty against a righty, I don't even know if he's a righty on the mound, probably. Take out IKF. Yeah, he's a righty. And put in Danny Burgers. That's the easy pin. Because he sucks offensively. Put in Danny Burgers. Might be the best graphic so far since Boris. Dude, it's, it's, I think it's my favorite. <laughs> Danny Burgers. Come on. Way inside. Had a boy. Had a boy. I'll play it again if he, gets, if he does something positive here, everybody. Come on, Danny. Come on, Danny. 240 people in here right now, guys. All for Danny Burgers. All for Danny Burgers. 1 0. Fires. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, Got it, boy. Hey, Danny works his walks. Get on. Bring up MVP. I love I wonder what they're going to do here. Um, maybe you bring in David Schneider, like, come in for it. 2 0 right now on Daniel Vogt. What am I saying? Danny, Danny Burgers. Burgers. Okay, that one's a little bit high. Clips the zone, though. I can't believe I almost said that. <laughs> <laughs> Bringer, 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 bringer. <laughs> yeah. Doing one right now on Burger. Got a boy, Danny. Three and one. Takes that one in the dark. Come on, Danny. I love how there's literally a guy in the league named Burger. But yeah. this guy is more <laughs> of a burger than him. <laughs> of course. He embodies. Burger, 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 burger. Three and one to Danny Burgers. Come on, baby. Deals. Ooh, oh, Danny Burgers. I, I would have loved a Danny Burgers. I would have lost it. I would have lost it. I would have lost That's it. That's what championships are fucking built off of, folks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Three, two, full count on Burgers. Come on, Danny Burgers. Come on, Let's baby. go nuts. Come on, Burgers. Let's go nuclear. Bowser all right, off, stays all right. alive. Out of boy. Out of boy. This is my guy. Remember 2020 when we had this man? I know, dude. He, he had like four at-bats, and then he was gone. Full circle. And, and I remember thinking, why did we do that? I understand. Uh, we were looking for this guy. Yeah. The potential. Full count right now on Danny Burgers' deals. That one is going to oh, be hit. Oh, and... Danny Burgers does not come through there. That is an out. One more time. I, I love the graphic. <laughs> Danny Burgers, everybody. Ah, <laughs> oh, the Blue Jays. Ah, oh, the Blue Jays. Uh. All right, bottom of the seventh coming up. Blue Jays will have six outs to try and get five runs here. Oh, boy.
Uh, I'd rather have an eggplant parmesan sandwich, says Roger Lambert. <laughs> sure. All right. We've got 230, oh no, 240 people in here right now. If you're just tuning in, boys are down bad. These boys, those boys out there, down by five runs going into the bottom of the seventh. We're probably going to be pitching some pretty dookie dudes. Uh, I don't know who's coming in for the Blue Jays. I wonder if Wes Parsons still going to be out there. I don't, I don't know. I'm not familiar with how often or how long this guy pitches for. Like, what is this guy's pitch count? How many innings can he give you? I have no idea. If I'm John Schneider, I'd probably put in, like, Mitch White. You know, give me two innings, Mitch White, and uh, close out this game so I don't have to burn any more guys. That feels like something you should do. We'll see what happens. All right, if you guys are just tuning in, hit that like button. Smash that subscribe button, guys, everybody. Because we're gonna be going live again tomorrow, hopefully for at least the series split. That would be nice. We've got Kikuchi on the mound. The Kikuchi is loose. Yo, you know what we should do? Oh, it's Ernie Clement. Ernie He's in Clement third base. is in. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. We should do a Blue Jays Today event day Looney Dog Night. Looney Dog Night, Blue Jays Today meet up at the like game. Like Tuesday? That would work. You know? That would work. 0-1 right now. West Parson's still in the game. Swing and a miss by Rosa Reina. 0-2. The squad comes. The squad pulls up with the full intention of trying to down as many dogs as we collectively can. 0-2 <laughs> on a Rosa Arena. That one's in the dirt. That would be good. Let us know. Is that? Would you come to that? Would you come to that? Be real. 1-2 right now on a Rosa Arena. Yeah, we haven't actually uh, scheduled any meetup games. This could be it. This is going to be a ground ball. Easy That's play. It, there you Easy go. play. Ooh, quick yay. Not the whole yay. Yeah, we've been waiting for, uh, we're, we're going to be partnering with Greta Bar in Toronto. It's opening up this April, maybe May. Uh, we've been waiting for some confirmations on that for some meetup games. Uh, haven't heard any word yet, but it's coming. So that's happening, but also we want to schedule again our classic like meetup games and shit in the actual arena. That one's popped up. Is it going to be in play? Flatty? We got to play on it? Nope. Got to play. Method, Method says, I'd rather not get cancer. Listen. <laughs> Listen, man. It's for the team. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 0-1 right now, and Isaac Paredes, West Parson at 35 pitches. It ain't over till it's over. I'm not, it, look, what, what did I say? I said, wait till the 8th. If we don't put up in the 8th, it's over. Yeah, but. yeah, yeah. And we should have our big guys coming up, so That's we'll have MVP, is. Biggio, leading off, and then top of the lineup. It's not over 100%. I've seen bigger comebacks. Oh, God. Come I on, guys. It. We've all seen bigger comebacks. Yeah, I need it, man. That would be just such a story. 0-2 oh, on Paredes. Get him here, Wes. Have a good inning here, Wes. Ah, uh, it's going to fly out. Come on, get there. There you go. Oh. Kiermaier. Okay. Two gone. <laughs> Back to oh. yeah, respect. Yeah, 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 yeah. Quick work right here from Wes Parsons. Get some two two innings out of Wes. He'll give up one. Hopefully, it's just the one, and uh, we'll take it. And then I guess who are you gonna pitch next? I don't know. This can burn. Dugan, here's Palacios. First pitch. Gonna be uh, swung on. Ninety-five right there. This is, all right, foul us away. Hold on. If you guys haven't even done so with the 200 people watching, please hit the like button and smash the subscribe button, everybody. Mm -hmm. it, uh, it truly does help the community, and uh, let's face it, you know, best community out there. So yeah, you guys are dope. There. Bottom of the seventh, 0 2, two outs. Parsons deals. That one is Ooh. high upstairs. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. You guys doing good. Come on. One, two. 
Yeah, dude, I don't know if you've seen the lineup. Oh, that was a little bouncer. I don't know if you saw the, the lineup for the Buffalo Bisons, but they look stacked. Oh, dude. I it's did gross. see it. I did see Yeah, well, I said I, I messaged Addison Barger after the game. Yeah. And, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I looked at the lineup as well, right? But you got, you know, Barger and Hamagiani uh, and uh, Reves Martinez. Orwitz, 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 Hey, we got a dono from Michael Goodridge. Shout out to you as well. Michael Goodridge saying, I'm having fried rabbit on Sunday. <laughs> Fuck the Easter Bunny. Dude, listen. Um, my girlfriend would hate me if I said this, but rabbit? Oh, it's a taste. It's a taste. <laughs> Two oh. innings left of baseball. Blue Jays looking to do some work. And before they do, let's shout out the other sponsor of oh, yeah. this video. Tim Hortons! Roll up to win, everybody. There's only a couple days left. Yeah. There's only a couple days left That's to right. go to Tim Hortons to, to get, you know, buy a coffee, buy a tea, buy a hot chocolate, buy, buy something. Get your chance to roll up and win. Yesterday, Adam, out of nowhere, this guy's hitless, dude. He's he's the coldest guy that I've ever seen at the plate. Pulls out the roll up thing, yeah. rolls it up, yeah. and what does he do? He wins six months of yeah. Sportsnet Plus Premium. I, I promise you guys, you can win a bunch of stuff there. It's actually a lot of fun. So shout out to Tim Orton's yes. roll up to win. We need to announce the player of the game brought to you by Tim Horton. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it again. Let's try we again. need to announce the player of the game brought to you by Tim Hortons. Roll up to win. For me, it's clear. It's got to be George Springer. Yeah, George Springer with back-to-back -back Springer dingers. It actually so far as we're recording right now, it's the only run the Blue Jays have scored in this game. But it was an awesome one, man. George Springer, we needed the power to come back. That's vintage George Springer, a threat at the top of the lineup. And he deserves it, man. If anyone's going to get it, it's clearly going to be him in this one. Yeah, well, right now, he's on pace for 162 home runs on the season. That's pretty good. Is that good? You tell me, right? Shout out to George Springer for being absolutely phenomenal. We need you to pop off, and he is popping off. Yeah, guys, and once again, shout out to Tim Hortons. We're up to win. The whole... It should... Let me clip it again. Uh, again, guys, shout out to Tim Hortons, roll up to win. Uh, we are going on till March 31st, so guys, make sure to download the app and play. Roll up to win. Owen 2 on Cavaliers. That's for our clip, guys. We're going to be coming out later on our socials. Yeah, we got to clip it. But seriously, Tim Hortons is phenomenal, so go do it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Davinsky still in the game, 26 pitches. He's up against uh, MVP Vigio. Oh, let's go. Hey, Guitar Geek says that I also got the six months of premium. Yo, elite. Nice, nice, dude. Yeah, that's good value. That's going oh. out. Oh, it feels like they're just not falling for us today, guys. Mm -mm. It feels like they're just not falling for us. Battery's running. Mm. Is it here? All right, George Springer. He's up with uh, he, the player of the game. George Springer's up. That one's in the dirt. 1 0. Oh, Mr. Springer. Come on, Springer. What can we do here, guy? Even better. Even better. That's a grounder up the middle, but that's played perfectly. And that's a quick second out. The Blue Jays feel like. This one is going to end in a loss. Classic little loss here for the Blue Jays. Here's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. What can we do here, Daddy? Get a double in the gap or something and make yourself feel good. That's a perfect pitch in the outside corner. Strike one. Thank you, Mad Dog Canada. Appreciate it. Vladdy with a base hit? 
There you go, buddy. Two for three on the day is Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Not a boy. Yup. Good stuff there, Vladdy. Out of boy. At least if we're going to lose, we still got our boy getting base hits. You know, it doesn't matter. Two gone, and it's Boba Shet. Oh, wow. That base hit was an exit velocity of 110 miles per hour. That looks good. Boba Shet fouls that one away. That's my last chance for my bet here, Bo. Make me a winner. The problem is you oh, I only lost. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> well, actually, if you go yard, I'm, no, still, no, down. I'm still down. I'm still down. Yeah. Go yard, though, you know, and then maybe uh, go yard, Turner. 0-1 <laughs> oh, on Bobo. Oh, pops it up. Get out of play. Yanni, get it. Oh, no, he's going to make the play. Wow. And that's it. That's, the, that's that inning right there. Just like that, guys. Holy mother of God. We are just getting sat down, offensively speaking. Not... The offensive game you wanted no. for your Toronto Blue Jays. No, no, no. I just got to drink the pain away. That's all you That's got. All we got. That's all we have. That's man. all we have right now. <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing. There's nothing else to really be looking for to in this game. Maybe a Turner is first hit, and that's it. That's why, guys, we need a uh, alcohol sponsor. Okay. Yeah. Just drinking the pain drink away. Drink the pain away with X sponsor. Yeah. See how easy that fits. You know, what the heck? Perfect. Hmm. Little kid, he had a bad day at the plate. But at least, this commercial I'm right now, I'm narrating. At least he's got his Blue Jay Bird feeder. <laughs> Brought to you by Armstrong. A <laughs> uh, glimpse of what the season will look like. No, 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 no. Hey, I mean, <laughs> maybe yes, maybe no. Maybe yesterday we get some of those games, and then some other days we get some of these games. You never know. That's the thing, right? It's going to happen. Uh, I didn't, well, I did expect us to win this one, but we're not going to be dominant for 162. We're going to lose eventually. Sadly, we're losing yeah. right now. But we will be back with a vengeance mm -hmm. and a force tomorrow. Mm -hmm. A back with a vengeance and a force tomorrow, everyone. So lock in. What's the game time? Three? It's four. Four? I think. Four ten. Let me double check. Such weird time. Like, why, why at four? It will be 410. Kukuchi versus mm -hmm. Little. That's the game. Everyone, yeah. All right. Bottom of the eighth. Effectively, this will probably be the last inning if you count a bottom frame and a top frame because the Rays are winning and they will not play. Bottom frame, y'all know. Home teams don't play that when they're smoking another team. Roger says, Blue Jays Today community is the greatest community in the multiverse. You're absolutely correct, dude. Damn right. Want to know right now on Harold Ramirez. Ooh, they're scary. Actually, hasn't got a hit yet. Whole series. Ooh, wanted that one, though. One one. Parsons still out there. Okay. I didn't know you had this game in you, Parsons, to just give us 50-plus pitches. All right. Wow. So literally, if we just use we just use Parsons, to, hopefully. Yeah, I guess that was the that was maybe part of the reason why they brought him up. Yeah. They're like, you know what? If we're down, this guy will just play the rest, and we don't care. That's true. He did open for us uh, when we secured a playoff spot last year. I didn't. I forgot that he can give us length. Yeah, there's some length there for Parsons. Fires. That one is in dirt. Two and two. Well, then maybe, maybe if there is a hope, we tie it, and we can bring in somebody else like Jimmy. We put up five le yesterday. We're not going to yeah. be putting five up every single day in an inning, Ooh. but it's not impossible. Chopper. This is an out. Oh, oh, and Wes Parsons throws it away. There's and an error. That's an error. That's an error. There you go, Wes. Jesus. Tried Jesus, to throw guys. He tried to throw it over the base runner. Uh, you can't really do that, Wes. You can't throw it over them. You can't do that. Oh, gee. he got stuck in a... Yeah, yeah he's why, just trying why to do Why are you doing much. that, dude? Like, take, take a second, move a shift to your... It's tough, but you can do it. 
error charge to Wes Parsons. Jesus, right as we're talking them up and then wow. that happens. That's four errors by the Blue Jays today. Wow. Yeah. Ugly. Yeah. Here's Jose Siri who's having quite a game with the stolen bases. No call there. One on one. Wow. A little hoppy hop from Jose Siri. Uh, we've got 182 of you guys still in here. Appreciate y'all sticking around. Okay, we get that call, thankfully. A little more hoppy hop from Jose Siri. <laughs> We're really getting to know these Rays in this series. I feel like we'll uh, have a lot to say about them the time we face them. Yeah, we're learning the characters here. I don't like you, Jose Siri. <laughs> he's good. And he's a good defender. This should be That's two. One. He's fast. And you get him. Two. There you go. All right, there you go. Error is eliminated. <laughs> Here's eliminated. I love it. There's Ernie Clement making his statement. I've not seen David Schneider yet. No, I haven't seen David Schneider. I haven't seen Brian Servan yet. What if he gets a what if he gets a start tomorrow? I would love actually if David Schneider started at third base for us tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. No, you know? I, I I hear what you're saying, man. Yeah, like again, like the guy was too good last year not yeah. to give him his at bats. Yeah. Because I truly believe that, especially in baseball, rhythm and yes. timing is just critical. And yes. you can't really expect a guy to just regularly, and it's like, oh, you're playing today, and then you get three days off, and you're playing again, and then yeah. you're playing the game after that, but then you get four days off, and then you're playing. You know, it's like, that's yeah. just fucking hard. That's a base, that's a base, base knock from Rort Vet. Wow, Rort right. Vet is like West Parsons fucking kryptonite. Yeah, literally. All right, Wes. Get this next out here. Heard that you're elite. Uh, I like Ernie, says Connie. Me too. I think uh, we're gonna see. I don't know if we are gonna see Ernie in this inning. Who who would be up? It'd be Turner. Yeah, Ernie's in for Vogelbach, which would be eight. Yeah, unless we have a big inning, we're probably not gonna see Ernie. That's uh, ripped and fair. Oh, and fair. And this, this could run? be a run. It's going to be close. Don't, Don't oh no. Knows. Yeah, he's got a big arm. Good green light, or good stop sign by the third base coach. And that's a double. Runners on second and third. And here's Yanni Diaz coming up. Whoa. This uh, could be a big loss. <laughs> yeah, could be. Could be. Ugh. Did they let Wes Parsons do this? Oh. It looks like they're gonna. Yeah, I mean, it might looks as well. like they're gonna. Why, why burn another guy? Keep him in there. All yeah. Right. Wow, he's had 54 pitches, dude. That's crazy. Yeah, let him go, I guess. That strike. There you go, Wes. Out of boy. Out of boy. Out of Diaz is one for four. Two runs. A single. Right, he got on via air. How he scored. Oh, a little swing. Defensive swing on 0-1. It's 0-2 now. Yeah, I guess they're warming up Jason Adam. The next inning. He's good. Count a little short arm throw. 0-2. Oh. He deals. Come on, just chase it, Yandy. Just out of the setting. He won't, though. That's the thing. He's I'm not gonna. gonna. He's not gonna, dude. He's a bit too good. He's, He's just really a good. bit too good. That's really good. O2 on Yandi. And he, that's, that's a base, a base hit. hit. And that's two runs for the Tampa Bay Rays. They're gonna put up an eight <sighs> spot here in this game, too. They match yeah. the Blue Jays. And that's game. Oh, yeah. That's, that's game. game. Oh, yeah, that's game. It was game a while ago, but that's officially game, everybody. And, uh, yeah, Yandy Diaz sure. having a freaking series yeah. against the Toronto Blue Jays. Oh, we're looking at this replay of Brandon Lau's Grand Slam. I like these little figures, and they show exactly what they did. Uh, oh, swing and a miss. 
Brandon Lowe having a good game. 0 1. What's going on? Well, see you all tomorrow, Sister Greens. <laughs> I totally understand, dude. Yeah. We will be here tomorrow. Yeah, we'll we be will here. be here tomorrow, everybody. We we'll will be here tomorrow. We'll see you there, guys. But we're going to be here to the end of the game. That's for sure. If you want to stick out, stick it out with us. And uh, we'll be here. Own one. Brandon Lau. Oh, did they just let him take second, I guess? Yanni Diaz with a little uh, defensive it indifference. Doesn't matter anymore. Oh, yeah. popped up. This should be the end of the inning. All right. Gone. Ah, right, Kieran, I throw it into the stands, and let's get the boys up. Justin Turner to lead it off our show, then Kirk to face Adams. Bleh. Ten hits for the Rays to the Blue Jays' five. Three errors. Uh, are they missing an error there? Because we had Bo Bichette with three. We had two different things. That was things. a mistake? It must have been a mistake on the. Yeah, I didn't yeah, think like, that. I thought he got two. Yeah, oh, I think they might have just took it away. I think they might have just took it away. E where is it? Where oh, is this? Uh, Blue Jays, yes. Yeah, they took it away. Down to two. Dude, I love okay. this commercial. Like, look at this. It's just like. <laughs> What is that? It's it's King Kong with a uh like it feels like an infinity gauntlet on his hand <laughs> and and God like he Zilla. needs it. Uh and they're yeah, like it's just them, like they're gonna fight. You know? <laughs> but you wanna watch them fight? <laughs> um if it were me, I don't know. Uh, well that's depressing. What are we going to talk about on our podcast coming up? Yeah, I've been thinking about that. I've got to do some more thinking after the game. Yeah, like... More thinking about this. All right. Let's see this top of the night. Yeah, I'm ready to turn the page and go to tomorrow. Yeah, the Brandon Love Grand Slam was just that was that shifted everything. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> then you start pitching Wes Parsons, he gives up three runs and all snowballs. Yeah, I mean, like though this. Uh... I I guess I can't even fully put it there. Like, I'm gonna say, well, this loss is on the offense, but mm -hmm. it's also on the pitching. Day. It's just everybody yeah. kind of. And then the defense was terrible. Like, yeah, yeah all around bad game. Terrible for the Blue game. Jays. Just a terrible game. Yep. Throw it out. This is why you play 162. Throw this one out. Yep. Time. You gotta wait for the. Yeah, you gotta wait for Turner to look at him. Last duel says maybe we can put up eight. Maybe. We just got to go uh, two Grand Slams. Correct. All right. Here we go. Ball. Yep, two Grand Slams will win us the game. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we don't even know. Justin One Turner. Oh. Uh, wow. Okay, we just took that one. All right, that was right down the middle, guys. Just taking it. One and one. He deals. And fouled it away. Yeah, Adam's got that short arm delivery. It's like a catcher. Yeah. You know, it just comes out like that. Well, he had a two, uh, below three ERA last year, so yeah. apparently it's very difficult. And the fact that, yeah, like you, you can short arm it, but get that velo yeah, like that. Yeah, that, that is impressive. That's the thing, right? It's like if you can get the velocity there, then, yeah, of yeah. course, do it. You know? Yeah. I found, like, you had more control when I pitched, too. Like, I didn't like going all the way around and up. Like, it was just too much, like, variables on your way towards your, your release. Yeah. I liked it. They try. I remember that my pitching coach growing up wanted me to do this, and I was struggling with command. And then they're like, "Okay, he's like, okay, go back to the short arm. Short arm was more accurate. 
I well, would, if you less think movement. about it, right? Yeah, exactly. Like, there's just less room for error. Like, exactly. You know, if you could just. Oh, Turner with his first with base his hit! First base hit of the Toronto Blue Jays 2024 season. It's going to be a double. That's something. Yeah, we'll take it. There you go. There you go, buddy. What can we get? 102 off the back. Good job, Justin. Get that monkey off your back. Keep that pine tar on there. We're going to need more of those doubles from you, buddy. Bank. Ooh, wow. could not scoop that. Couldn't scoop it up. All right. Varsho now, who got his first hit of the season earlier today. That one's outside, ball one. Do we have a rally cooking here, everybody? I mean, like, theoretically, yeah, like, I'm going back to that conversation about throwing, like, theoretically, like, the shorter you can get your arm, like, I guess the more you do, because the less that these guys can figure out what it is. And, like, yeah. Like, if you could just, like, literally shot put the baseball yeah. in that, there, you know? That's going to be a chopper. Varsho moves run over to third. He's out. All right, Alejandro Kirk, what do you got, buddy? Kirk, can he drive in an RBI here? That'd be nice. That's high. Oh, yeah. That, that Tony says, uh, there's a tear in my beer and I'm crying for them <laughs> here. I don't know that song, but I know what it is. Sounds like something I feel like right now. Yeah. There's a tear in my beer. 0-1-1 right now on Kirky. Deals. Oh, oh ouch. Wow. Right off the umpire. Foul yeah, back. Good. Teach this guy a lesson. <laughs> <laughs> Get something out of it before you guys go. Yeah. Owie. All right, 0-2 on Kirk. Come, Come on, Kirk. Come on, Kirk. Find a way, man. Find Please. a way. Please. Please. Time. It's on Kirk. <laughs> I just want to at least be like, oh, okay, well, you got a hit today. Yeah. That's yeah. all I'm looking for right now. Yeah. You got a hit in our RBI. Yeah. Give us that. Get the run home, man. Get the run home. Go two. There you go. That should do it. That should get the RBI home. That will get an RBI home. Wow, we're, we're really hitting the warning track every time. Yeah. Today, yeah. Well hit baseball from Alejandro Kirk there. Doesn't fall for a hit, but does get the ribby. So. Yay. I mean, in a game that wasn't wow. down by eight, you know, you'd, you'd Dude, be happy about it. It's kind of funny. Uh, we go 8 2 yesterday. I and know. Now it's 8 2 again today. We are literally team. completely even. Both teams put up 10 runs and gave up 10 runs. Both have a run differential of zero right now. Mm -hmm. Make that, make that plus one, Kiermaier. Let's go. Hit a dinger. Both teams are going to be one on one after this. So. Yeah, we are even as hell. Ooh, swing and a miss. Kiermaier likes to swing at those breaking balls down low. They keep throwing it. He's 0 for 3. Is that girl in the background? Yeah. He's, yeah. He's, uh... 0 and 1 right now on Kevin Kiermaier. Out of deals. That one goes outside. Wow. We've got 188 people in here, guys. You guys are awesome for sticking out for this Blue Jays game two, this opening day weekend series. One and one. Jeremiah fouls off that one. That was a good pitch to take a hack at. Got 204 likes in the stream too, guys. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. Thank you guys so much. Here's the one, two. That's high, that's high. We, you dropped something there, Kiermaier. A little sliding glove. Two and two. Kiermaier. This could be the game, and I think it's going to be. Oh, yeah. Looking down at the score bar. 
And big, oh ugly God. swing and chase. That kind of <laughs> highlights the entire game right there. Just watch wow. that one Kiermaier swing at the end. That's all you need to know about this Toronto Blue Jay game. And the Toronto Blue Jays lose their second game of the season, 8-2. to two. They put up 8-2 oh. to two in the first, looked incredible. And then the Tampa Bay Rays said, nuh-uh, we're just as good as you, and d literally did exactly the same thing <laughs> as we did. That's tough. It was a tough watch. Um, the boys are going to be better, and we're going to be here for it, guys. Yep. We're going to be live again tomorrow at 4 to watch these Toronto Blue Jays, yep. and then again on Sunday. You guys are the yep. best community in the internet. I know I've been saying that a lot, but I, I truly do. Uh, you. you guys are, man. Like, all across the board, we have people from all around the world, and, you know, you truly, we're all together being a community of just Blue Jay fans, no matter who we are, where we come from. We love the Toronto Blue Jays. Had a great first game. Not so good second game, but you know we're gonna stick here and stick with it with the boys throughout the entire year, man. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. And as always, Go, go Jays, Jays, go! My <laughs> KF has to go. He's got <laughs> <laughs> I guess so. <laughs>